Hello, everyone. In the last episode, uh, Chloe died. Shot in the head. And we were left on quite the cliffhanger. Max has been injected with some sort of drug, I'm assuming. So she's been captured by Jefferson, who I guess is potentially in partnership with Nathan and the Prescott's. Not really sure what's going on there. Uh, things are kind of a mess. And we also seem to say our goodbyes to a lot of characters in the last episode. So I'm really curious where it's going to go from here. Like mm. if we'll have our like finale thing with Jefferson and then maybe go back home, leave Blackwell. Um, are we going to be able to bring Chloe back or is she done for good? Of course, we want to say a big thank you to everyone who has joined us for this series. It's been a lot of fun. I'm super glad that there are other games that we have yet to play and this episode may be one whole episode like the finale that's it we'll just have to see but it has been a good ride and i'm glad i'm really glad we finally got around to playing yes. it on the channel it's been a year in the making i guess it's time to begin the last episode of life is strange remastered <laughs> <laughs> all right episode five friends. The polarized. final episode is called Polarized. It has Chloe in it. Could be a, could be a, yeah. But it could just be. What if she's like in the other are they world? Like, it looks like they're facing the tornado, but yeah. who knows what this actually means. The vortex. Also, before we begin, how are we feeling about the shirt? I have a new shirt. I throw out the newly thrifted shirt. Yeah, I like this one. I like the color, the Bur vibe. Burgundy? Mm -hmm. wow. It's kind of like, I don't know what texture you would call it. It's like, it's like. It's like Partly corduroy? It feels yeah, like corduroy. Yeah, a little bit, like light. A corduroy so light. A soft corduroy, yeah, there you go, light. <laughs> All right, here we go. <laughs> we want Jefferson. We want him. Oh, we know. Oh, we know. Does it always say that? I don't think so. Maybe it said it at the beginning of the, the first one. Are we in the bunker? Oh, no. Damn, we're probably tied up. This isn't good. Mm -mm. Damn. If our hands are if our hands are tied, we can't like fully use our power, I don't think. Hmm. Who's on the right? Is that, that looks like Ward. Yeah, that's what I was gonna say. What? Oh shit. What oh, is it, Nate? They think it'll be here too. Yeah. Is it just duct tape? I know it looks like straps, but I can't tell. But we did see duct Is tape. Anybody out there? Please help! Oh shit! Okay, who's over here? Oh, Victoria! What? How did? I guess we didn't tell her not to trust Jefferson. Yeah. Oh shit! Jefferson kidnaps Victoria too. This is so bad. She looks out. Victoria, wake up. Wake up. Mm -hmm. 
He's probably not going to be gone long. Right. Um, oh, God. I don't remember anything that happened. This must be the same drug Nathan used on Kate. Yeah. Mm. Oh, shit. That's me. Uh, he took that shot last night. Trolley, can I kick it or something? Of course. And right in front of me. Great. I can see all my things, but I can't grab it. Okay, I have a feeling this isn't gonna work, but... Damn. Help! Somebody help me! Oh. Wow. Finally. Okay. I'm free. Almost. There you go. I'm so scared. He could come back at any moment. Oh, uh, look over to the right real quick. The right. Up there? I thought I saw something. Okay, it's just the the photo. Yeah. Um, what can we do here? Can we The syringe? Kick? Can I use my Oh, I can still use my powers. Oh. Okay. Hmm. Do you think I messed something up? Like out of like is there a certain sequence you need to do? I'm just missing something, but is there anything else? Doesn't really seem like it. No. <sighs> okay, you come back over. If I could move it towards me. <sighs> the photo? Looking at myself oh, like that. Okay. You'll pay yeah. for this, Jefferson. Oh. Wait. We're gonna go back? <laughs> oh shit. I promised I would never go back in time like this again. But this is the only way. <gasps> but won't we still be out of it? Be, I wonder. Uh, so we can do this with any photo. Yeah. Not just ones that were like. Come on. We go. Particularly attached to. Come on. You got it? Me. There we go. Oh, Max. Ooh. Bro, Jefferson, you creep. What a bastard. This angle highlights your purity. See, the slightly unconscious model is often the most open and honest. No vanity or posing, just pure. Expression. No Victoria oh, yet. Christ. Look at that perfect face. His voice even changes. Yeah, he sounds like 20 times. Hold that year. stare there! Stay still! Wow. <laughs> oh, Max! You fucked up my shot! But please don't worry. We have all the time in the world. For now, I knew you were special the second I saw your first selfie. Yes, I still hate that word. Jeez, this is dark. But I love the purity of your own image. Not like Rachel, who was always looking in the wrong places. Poor Rachel. Wait. He probably killed her. Let me try this angle. Don't move! Oh. Oh, much better. Thanks, Max. If only Nathan could see this setup. He tried so hard. Tried. But you can't just throw a few subjects around and expect a cohesive style or theme hmm. but he had an eye for shadows had an eye. eye for a whole lot more as his elite family will find out along with arcadia bay is he gonna pin this all on nathan maybe God. oh those eyes 
All right, Max, let's do it. It's just too bad you're so goddamn nosy, Max. But this room is under 24-7 surveillance, so all I had to so do was text you from Nathan's phone, and you fell right into my hands. Wow. You really should have focused on schoolwork, not private detecting with your little friend. Chloe. Chloe, right. Yeah, I'm sorry that I killed it. That Nathan killed her in yeah, self-defense. Yeah, that's what he's doing. Okay. But she had a troubled history like most Arcadia Bay dropouts. Nobody will be surprised. Or care. We do. Though I promise, people will care when you die tonight, Max. I wasn't lying when I said you have a gift. Okay. Now this looks good. Maybe a few oh more Oh my close -ups. gosh, really? Yeah, we need to take him. We need to take him out. Max, please do not move so much. I need you posed and framed my way. Maybe a new dose no. will calm you down. No. No. This is our chance. Now don't move, or this will hurt much. There we go. Stupid bitch! You just don't listen, do you? In fact, you never did hear much in my class. If oh you had, gosh. you might have seen all this coming. Don't blame this on God, me. Damn, you are a fighter, though. I've had my eye on you, and I've noticed that you've been more fearless this week than maybe your whole life. Remember my number one rule. Always take a shot. It's an sh actual shot, literally. Will that help us, though? Or did we already do that? So then we'll be like back. Kicking the. Okay, so what exactly did we change? Because we broke the vial. Which means he can't use it on Victoria. Oh, that's ruined. I can't believe that happened. So sick. So now it's different. <laughs> um, okay. She looks still out of oh, it. Oh shit. Okay. Jefferson. That's the same. Victoria. Hey, Victoria. It's Max. Can you hear me? Max. Oh, oh. Oh, God. Did she give her less Where? stronger Where are we? Ghosts? Oh, what's happening? Girl, you've been dropped like Kate and me. Do you remember how you got here? No, I don't know. Wait, you warned me. You warned me about Nathan. Then, then I went to Jefferson for help, and he was acting so weird. Damn. That's the last thing I remember. And I can't move my hands. Help me, Max. Please. I'm sorry for everything. <laughs> Listen carefully. Mark Jefferson kidnapped us. He's using Nathan as well. Jefferson is very dangerous, so we have to get out of here before he comes back. Max. I just can't believe this is real. I know, right? I mm. don't want to die like this. I'm only 18. D Shh. I have a plan. Victoria, please I don't listen. know what it is, but I have one. I have a plan. Really? How? Max, I'm so scared. So am I. But... We don't have time to be yep. scared. Yeah, we gotta stay calm. We Let's have go. to fight back. Now. Max. I can't even move my arms. How are we supposed to fight? I'm not going to let that asshole get away with this. I just... I need you to be strong. I can't do this alone. We need Let's to act while we're clear-headed. If he doses us again, we'll forget everything. I'm mm. not strong, Max. Look at me. 
Look what I did to Kate Marsh. Now she's in the hospital, and I'm here. We'll see her again. Yeah. Hopeful. Kate wants us to get the hell out of here. And then we can both go see her again. Okay? I'd do anything to see Kate once more. Just to tell her I'm sorry. Let's Victoria, do it then. we will find a way to escape. I promise. Max, I believe you. All right. All right. What's the plan, Sarah? You said he had a plan. <laughs> well, what's this? Look around. Oh, I'm definitely more awake in this photo. Oh, another change? I could try this one. Oh. So we're just gonna keep changing things, I suppose. Yeah. Cause that's the same. I'd really like to smash that fancy camera into Jefferson's now face. I know what Kate had to go through. And I helped kill her. You didn't know anything. Don't think about that now. So it's like that was like meant for when she if she actually died. Wait. Jefferson couldn't handle stains on his photos. Oh, so he took them Good. out of the fold. Now yeah. I can use them. Got it. Okay, yeah. Okay, okay. okay. That was a big thing that you changed. All right. Wait, he left? Oh, bro oh, the broken vial. Okay. I broke those vials when I kicked the trolley. Hmm. All right. Let's go. How many photos did he take? What if he took one of Chloe? Dead? Whoa. I don't know. I I'm oh, definitely yeah. more Oops. awake in this photo. I could try this one. Let's focus. We gotta slowly. This work. Please work. I know it's tough because time still passes. Yeah. And so he could be like coming back. Like there could be an alter timeline already that where he does get away with this. I heard that. Why is he so I'm sick of Jefferson. I knew it. At the very first episode, I had a bad feeling from him. Now look at it. This angle highlights your purity. See, the slightly unconscious model is often the most open and honest. So this is all the same. Remember my number one rule: always take the shot. Hmm. So that didn't change at all. I hope it's not bugged or something. Yeah. Folder is in the way. What? Wait, now there's double folders? What? Whoa. I I'm definitely more awake in this photo. It uh, is bugged. It's bugged. Oh, no. Damn. Do you have to restart? Because you can't really look at the photo. <sighs> I can try focusing on it, but otherwise we might have to restart. Yeah. Damn. That's unfortunate. This might work. So we're just gonna be looking at a. Please work. Because this is the one that we just focused on, right? Yes. But it gave us the original. It gave us the original scene. Please? We need to be sitting? Okay, it's a different. Nice. I mean, not nice, but... Right. I'm getting some spectacular images here, Max. Yes, Victoria would kill to be in your place, but she doesn't understand our connection. We don't have a connection. You're don't kill the winner, Max. I choose you. Your portrait. Fuck you. <laughs> you're trying too hard. I know you're scared. You all... Have the same doe-eyed look when you wake up here. 
replaced by fear as you realize what's about to happen. Mm -hmm. Mr. Jefferson, why are you doing this? Oh, Max. I'm so glad you asked that question. Uh, simply put, I'm obsessed with the idea of capturing that moment innocence evolves into corruption. That shift wow. from black to white to gray and beyond. Most models are cynical. They lose that naivete. However, some Blackwell students carry their hope and optimism with them like an aura. And those that. lucky few become my models. My lucky. subjects. Yes. You're a psychopath. And this is your last session. Yeah. Au contraire, Max. I'm so sane that nobody knows what's happening to you right now. As you can see, sleeping beauty here is too harsh for my gentle lens. And don't get me started on your late partner. I had enough of those faux punk sluts in my Seattle days. Go to hell. <laughs> you will for everybody you've hurt. Unlike yep. your sweet Kate Marsh. I don't believe in that bullshit. She could have been my masterpiece. The world is what an artist makes it. And my muse. Blah, 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 blah. blah, blah, blah. God, I hate <laughs> your voice now. You might as well savor it, considering it's the last you'll hear. Oh. <laughs> that struck a nerve. Your face changed color. Beautiful. You will not get away with this. I want you to know that. Too bad you already made a convincing argument against Nathan in the principal's office. Thank you so much for setting him up for me. I do know that the Prescotts too, are going though, to have right? a major scandal when the town finds it, out what their elite son has been doing for stuff. homework. Well, he definitely used you him. You used Nathan. I prefer the term manipulated. Like with an image. Nathan's was easy to twist around. I became a sort of father figure for Nathan. It happens often in teacher-student relationships. It was kind of touching for a while. Wow. Did you tell him everything about your plans at Blackwell? Don't be stupid, Max. I told him what he needed to hear. In return, I had access to the Prescott fortune. Who do you think paid for this glorious darkroom and equipment? Right. How else could I get all these hip new drugs for my subjects? Hip. Rachel Amber was your victim. Not your subject. Oh. Rachel Amber. Hm. That's the real tragedy. Nathan thought he could be an artist like me. Instead, uh, the dumbass gave her an overdose. Okay. Hmm. Why Rachel? Chloe and Rachel. That's why Rachel. Why Rachel? I don't have time to tell you everything. But she was special. A human chameleon, so many visual possibilities. We had a real connection. She let you take pictures? Or mm. did you know Frank? Frank? I feel like that's not relevant. Did she let you take pictures of her? Rachel was in love with me. That's not my ego. Just uh -uh. look at our sessions. Not that I'll let you. Nobody loved having their picture I don't, taken. You're not exactly a reliable anyway. narrator, Jefferson. Yeah. Rachel is dead. But no tears. Los Angeles would have killed her anyway. So look at this as a favor. What? You're evil. Oh, I see. You and your friends almost beat Nathan to death. See, we're uh, not so he different. Was fine. Yes, yes, we are. I cared more about Nathan than you did. No, you didn't. It's just too bad that he fell in lust with Rachel. He actually thought he could mimic what I do with the camera and subject, like father, but not like son. Where is Nathan now? Dead and buried. After what he did to Rachel, I knew I couldn't keep him as a protege for much longer. Now the police will never find his body. What? Do you finally get it now, Max? I can't compromise my vision with amateurs. You are an amateur. Look at the trail of death you left behind. You can't blame all this on Nathan. I don't care what you do to me. You're gonna die, motherfucker. <laughs> For Chloe and Rachel and everybody else. 
I do love your spirit, Max, but you brought yourself here. By your own choice. Anyway, I like my models to be seen and not heard. So I have to make sure there's nothing left behind of you. Wow, I didn't expect Nathan to okay. go. Now, mm. let's see how these shots came out. I can see why your instant camera is so appealing. Mm. You don't need a computer to print your work out. Um, with a heart I wonder if he, Nathan has the gun. Does that change anything? I don't know. I have all those photos in my diary. This could be a way out. Oh, we can. This Talk is purity personified. Maybe. So you can rewind? I guess so. Alright. These shots came out. I can oh. see what. Wait! Please, Mr. Jefferson. Max. I would love to talk shop, but I really need to go over these pictures. Especially while they're fresh in my mind. I think our session was a career high for me. Wow. My diary? Yeah. I feel like if you said show me the photos, he'd be like, ah, they're not for your eyes or something. Could you, Try it? could you show me the photos? That's the first time one of my models down here has asked me that. Of course you would. But I love that the last thing you'll ever see is yourself through my camera eye. Too perfect. That didn't work. Okay. Alone. Try something. Different. Oh, is Victoria on the couch there? I think I saw her on the I couch. With a heart. Wait. I have to go back. Yeah, there she is. Why would he give me our, my diary, though? What are you going to do? I mean. I think it's pretty obvious. Right. <laughs> Let's just try the diary. You... You still have my diary. Don't worry. Nobody's going to read it. Thanks for reminding me. There's okay, nothing more innocent than a teenager's diary. Oh. Look at your selfies. Maybe if he puts it on the cart. What a waste of talent. Look at that shot, Max. <gasps> You can do so much better. What, what photo is that? Can we go far back? I From mean, we beginning. can, right? In theory. We've done it before. Yeah. Alone with a heart. Oh my God. I could go all the way back to the is moment our first this day? all started. Yeah. Max. This could be your chance to fix everything for good. All right, I'm out of here. Including like, please work. Like from the very beginning, like Kate, Max. I wish you could see yourself oh, now. Tortured, right? And frankly, it's bullshit. <laughs> Holy shit! We just gotta tell, be like, yo, any one of you in a dark corner. <gasps> And capture you in a moment of desperation. Wow, the dialogue. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a Chloe. Selfie. A dumb He's gonna get shot. <laughs> right back where I started this insane week. And nobody course, is going to hurt Chloe know, ever again. Portrait has been popular since the early What 1800s. are we supposed to do though? Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. We're stuck in this room. Sorry. Yeah. I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, here? can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth <clears throat> to the first self-portraits? Would we just be sassy? Yeah. Hmm. Who cares? This class is hella bullshit. <laughs> I'll pretend you didn't say that and let you try to answer one more. Sorry, there's no time left. I mean, your class is almost over. Oh. 
Well, thanks for the warning, Max. <laughs> so, the Daguerrean process made portraiture quite popular, mainly because it gave the subjects clear defined features. You can learn more when you finish reading the assigned chapters. Clearly, Max doesn't have the uh, time. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday time Heroes. Time to change time. Okay, what do we do? Francisco, where you'll be feted by the First, artwork. let's make it real easy to capture Mark Jefferson. And Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Bastard. <laughs> yeah, it's so weird. So we can't go I have to warn David about Jefferson and the dark room. Oh, David. Yeah, because he's on to all this. This diary literally saved my life. Wow. I've got a ton of Blackwell brochures, so I hope David's number is in there. Okay, yeah, because we wouldn't have really it. Cell phone. All I need is David's number, and Jefferson is one text closer to life without parole. I hope I still love photography when this is done. Let's not to put on. Don't. Di did you know someday your pictures would actually alter it. time and space? Hopefully. Anything else to look at? Oh, I know you said, like, I'd be so mad if, like, David is the one that saves us. Ah, oh, you're right, though. <laughs> David's the one that comes in. Wow. Closer? I guess I can't really look at it. I hope Kate still ends up being fine. Yeah. I should be able to track down David's number from the school pamphlet. Okay. okay. Ugh, what does it say? After blazing a trail in the world of 1990s style and fashion photography, Mark Jefferson always knew he wanted to share his vision and inspire others. <laughs> in the late 2000s, he took a well-publicized detour into teaching around the country, inevitably ending up in a permanent position at Blackwell Academy. Mr. Jefferson's classes on art and photography are some of the most popular in the school's rich history. And his students will certainly go on to inspire others with their own vision. I mean, just think of how many of the red binders we saw. Yeah. There were a lot. Found you. What is he? 555-630-8243. We can, we can hit up Samuel as well, the custodian. <sighs> I'm scared. Warren David. For once, David, I'm praying you'll overreact to this as much as everything else. And take Jefferson down fast. You're after Rachel Amber, Mark Jefferson is guilty. His dark room is under the Prescott's farmhouse. You know the location, yep. he's sick and dangerous. Stop him. You wanted me to enter the contest, asshole. So maybe I'll be going to San Francisco. And Jefferson, you'll be going to prison. Hell yeah, Max, <laughs> let's go. Uh -oh. The past within the past. Shit. Yeah. Am I yeah, this pushing is a myself too hard? Trip Triple, double, you know, it's crazy. Yeah. Victoria, it's nice to know how you really feel. My phone is dead and I'm bored. Time to bust out my posy. Why did I give up the word for the image? Because I suck, but Mark Jefferson rolls. Everybody in here loves him, but he only seems to care about Maxie. I want to hate her, but she wouldn't care. Envy is a sin, Vic. Get over yourself. Oh, nice. I'm happy to fix it, so you'll be here to get your fancy camera, Victoria. Whoa. Everything has different context now. Yeah. Not impressed anymore. That's, that's, that's cool. Right. It's all different. It's a whole new look. Now I wonder how many victims Jefferson has left behind in his career. Yeah. I can't blame the cameras, but I just think of Jefferson using them. Only I could tell the whole class about Jefferson and watch him squirm. But I better let David take care of everything. I hope Max doesn't like push herself too hard and like ends up dying. I don't know. She better not. That would suck. The nineties are over for you, asshole. <laughs> well, we can't save Rachel, unfortunately. Kate. Kate. Can we say anything to her? Comfort. Poor Kate. Hi, Kate. Oh, hey, Max. Kate, listen to me. I am. Always remember that you're not alone. I've got your back no matter what happens. 
so do a lot of other people. We all care. We're all here for you. You need to know that. Max, that makes me feel so blessed for the first time this week. I, I don't know what to say. Wow. That's okay. Neither do I. Maybe we could both use a hug. Aww. Nice. What up, Kate? Thanks. You always know the right thing to do. So maybe, hopefully, like that only won't even happen. That whole incident. Yeah. Oh, Rachel. I'm sorry. Hmm. So we gotta save Chloe from Nathan again. Yeah. Oh, I yeah. We'll do anything different. This is the last time somebody bullies you, Kate. Yeah. Whoa. So weird. It is. It's really cool that they brought it back here, though. Yeah. There's still some beauty left in Arcadia Bay. Hmm. I still feel like the lighthouse is hmm. calling out to me. Yeah, we still have a lot of questions. I'd like to bust this up right now. Oh, oh I thought I was stuck. Victoria, I'm sorry you have to stand next to that psycho. What are we f gonna give him? You start fo like our photo for our entry? I can't go past these photo boundaries, so I need to fix everything from here. Okay. An everyday hero is going to bust your ass, Jefferson. <laughs> Okay, I think we are... Oh. Foots. Just a week ago, I was so naive about art, life, the world. All right, let's give him this picture, I guess. Okay, we do have our journal right now. Do you have any photos for this episode? Oh, yeah. Oh. That's what's on the desk or no it's not no it's not just kidding yeah it is that's it's oh. rachel rachel forever and kate i don't it kind of worries me wait we are gonna br be able to bring chloe back right go ape a car in a vortex and beers well clearly we have a lot left after we do all this a whale on fire mr jefferson we need to talk. Uh, Can you see I'm talking to Mr. Jefferson now? Yes, I see. But maybe you shouldn't. Uh, and why not? <laughs> Hold on, Victoria. Are you okay, Max? I will be when Victoria understands that hiding behind a screen, posting videos of people is incredibly cruel and unfair. You're smart enough to know how easy it is to hurt somebody. To destroy their life. I just want you to think about how much it would hurt if somebody did that to you. Mm. You can always make the right choice, Victoria. I know you've got a good heart. I've seen it. Listen, I... I didn't... You don't have to explain. There's no reason for you to be so insecure that you can't be happy with your Damn, own time. Yo, let's go, Max! <laughs> Wouldn't it be better to lift people up than to bring them down? Yeah. For sure. You could inspire people. Okay, I don't know what you're talking about now. Do I, Mr. Jefferson? I think I should stay out of this one, Victoria. Then I guess I'm done talking. And that's okay, too. Now to Mr. Jefferson. That was kind of random, Max. What did you mean? Here's my photograph for the Everyday Heroes contest. Oh, uh, that was easy. No, it wasn't easy at all. Well, I, uh, I, I can't prejudge yet, but I'm very happy you decided to enter. That means a lot to me. And Blackwell, the, the first step for any artist is to put themselves out there ah, get in the out world of here. without fear. To be innocent. Or wow. guilty. Uh, well, and thanks for the photo and... Maybe both of us will be jet-setting to San Francisco this Friday. Or maybe wow. only one of us will be going. <laughs> Don't be so modest, Max. 
Anything can happen in a week. Damn right, you're going to find out, Mr. Jefferson. Okay, so we could, we could be anywhere right now. Right. <gasps> so she's that's still fine. That's okay. Also fine. I'm trying to look for subtle changes. Oh, they went after Jefferson. The dark room. It was Nathan too. Hallelujah. Okay. Oh, so that's no. That's Kate about to jump. That's Rachel's body. She won the. And there's Victoria probably pissed. <laughs> Whoa! But but the press. But the sto but the storm's still coming. That's gonna be the next thing, I guess. Taxi. Taxi. Bro, David actually came in clutch. <laughs> of course he did. Whoa! We could be anywhere. Where Where's San we? Francisco? <gasps> Whoa! We're going to San Francisco. That's crazy. Okay. You're okay, Max. You're safe. On a plane. Who's next to you, Wells? I hope I did everything right this time. Do we have any, like, clues? Yeah, but there's a newspaper. Local teacher arrested. Good work, David. Holy shit, you roll, Max. I'm Chloe. so proud of my superstar. Oh, you're alive. Aww. Oh, you're alive. Yay, they did bring her back. They did it. We did it. They fixed everything. Well, sir. But. The storm. Yeah, we're leaving. Or we're coming back? Oh, maybe. Okay. First, journal. Journal. Wow. Wow. I have no idea where we left off. So this is okay. new. This is new. Here we go. I watched Chloe die again, killed by my favorite teacher. Why? Because we were stupid and let Jefferson trick us with a phony text. So we ended up back at the junkyard and fell right into his trap. We should have called the police the second we found Rachel, but I had gone along too far with Chloe. I keep thinking I'm invincible, that I'm a real everyday superhero, but no, I'm just Max Caulfield. Maybe all my powers are an accident of fate, or am I being punished like Chloe? What have we done to deserve all this pain? What did Rachel do? Kate? William? Then there's Mark Jefferson. I can't ever call him Mr. again. I'm still shocked that he turned out to be the one hiding behind the dark room. But if I think back on those pieces of time Jefferson has been dropping hints all along, it makes me sick to think how long he's been doing this for, and to whom. The needle. I can still feel that needle on my skin. Thank God I can't remember Jefferson posing me for most of his sick session. Imagine all those other people who had to suffer through that horror, like Rachel and Kate. That made me determined to get out of that room, at least to stop him and save Chloe. I had to use my focus rewind on multiple photos so often that I, even I got confused. Mm. Worse still, I knew I was screwing around with various realities again, but I had no other choice. Chloe would not die in a junkyard next to Rachel Amber, and there was no fucking way I was going to let Jefferson be the last person I ever saw. It's hard to even imagine myself in that studio alone with Jefferson acting like that. Everything was so neat and sterile, but it felt like the filthiest place on earth. If I didn't have this ability to bend time, what would I have done? What could I have done? Sometimes I felt removed, like I was looking at myself going through this hell. But thanks to Jefferson's class photo, he personally helped me escape. I also feel so terrible that Victoria had to end up in here with me, just because I warned her about Nathan. So if I hadn't warned her, she wouldn't have talked to him. That's really interesting. Oh. I should have known that she would rush to Jefferson for protection. 
Instead, he kidnapped her and almost murdered her because of me. Interesting. I'll never forget the way Jefferson looked at me, so cold and mean. I felt like I was on one of those awful true crime shows my mom binge watches. How does somebody become evil? He actually shot Chloe in the head. Just like that. Motherfucker. I wish the police had taken Nathan in after I told Principal Wells that he drugged Kate. He might still be alive, and maybe he would have taken down Jefferson too. Mm. Yeah, for, yeah, and he killed Nathan? That's crazy. I can't believe I was able to focus and rewind into my selfie all the way back to art class on Monday. I turned in my photo for the contest after I sent a text to David warning him about Jefferson. Woo. The only reason I haven't had a total meltdown is the fact that I do have this incredible power. I have to use it right for once, and maybe never again. It was weird to be in class with Jefferson, like I wasn't just tortured by him in an underground bunker. I saw him for the first time as he is, a creepy, manipulative psychopath filled with bullshit. Bullshit. He uses art and passion to seduce people, but behind that there's nothing but hate and perversion. I only pray that I can fix this timeline, not fuck it up. Okay. Damn, what are our texts like? <gasps> Whoa. Does it start from the very beginning? Maybe. Okay, wakey wakey eggs and bakey. Oh yeah, okay, some things have changed. Max, you there? Hello, what's going on? You okay? Crazy shit is going down. Step soldier called the cops and took yep. off. He had his gun. That is crazy, especially after hooking up with you again and that snow today. Everything's going to be okay. We're together again. Insert insult hue. <laughs> wow. Human emoji, text me back when you hear anything on it. Good morning. Your ass better be up if I am. Wakey, wakey, eggs and bakey. Wakey, bakey. So what happened last night? Step SWAT got home late last night, all jacked up about one of his investigations. He might be right for a change. You funny. So meet me at Two Whales ASAP. Okay, see you soon. Max, wish you had popped a cap in Frank's ass instead of giving him the gun. No, Chloe, I do not wish that. Okay, so that's the same. Mm-hmm. Why Rachel? Never... Max, thank you for being with me yesterday. I keep trying to wake up like this is a nightmare. Why Rachel? She never hurt anybody. No, she didn't. Chloe, I'm so sorry about everything. Dude, how do we get over shit like this? We live. Rachel would want you to have a great life. That's truly the best revenge. Now we really do have to take over the world. No, we just have to be there for each other. You are Saint Max. Yo, Max, Max, check this shit out. I had a little talk with Step Hero tonight. Wow. I'm all eyes. Since he busted Jefferson, he is a totally different person. He has been very cool and apologized <laughs> for his behavior. <laughs> That's so sweet, Chloe. Now you're family again. Woe down, sister. I did not cry in his arms. But he helped find Rachel and punish her killers. David obviously hella cares about my mom, and probably me. Yes, I am hella bored with nothing to do. What you doing, hippie? Some of us hippies have homework. No shit, Sherlock. And I already did my paperwork for Bay City College. Chloe's going to college? Nice. I'm proud of you. I hope so. Chloe, I won the Everyday Heroes contest. Sorry. Holy shit, you rule, Max. I'm so proud of my superstar. That's what we saw. This is just the start of your career. I'm just glad I can share it with you. Damn right. Plus, Max, you deserve to win. No emoji. <laughs> wow. Dead. I know mom is melting your phone. I understand why. Tell her not to worry. You're an adult now. You can tell her. I will. So that was that just when they found out about everything? Yeah. Dana. Max, Max, Max. Snap, snap, snap. I'm working on a new cheer for you. Dana, that is so awesome. I'm blushing. That's because you're on fire, girl. <laughs> what up, Kate? Kate. Hey, Max. You around? Okay, get tea. Thanks, Max, for helping me. No problem. That guy is an asshole. Is that David? Maybe. Max, thanks you, thank you so much for talking to me today in class. Things have been hard this week, and you showed up at the right time, like an angel. You're a great friend, and I'm so blessed. And don't you dare laugh. Never. You almost made me cry. Kate, just know that I'm always on your side. Maxo, XO. <laughs> Max, sorry to have bothered you by asking for your advice. Okay, right. That's the same choice. Thank you for answering my call. Yeah. Oh my god, Max, I can't believe that Nathan and Jefferson were arrested. Honestly, I'm in shock. I have to go talk to the police now and give a full statement. Please let me know if you need me there. We all have your back. 
Thank you, I'm scared, but I want to make sure both of them are put away and never hurt anybody again. Max, I heard that you won the contest and it made me so happy. Your photos are so real and wonderful. It gives me hope that you're going to be discovered now. Thank you, Kate. You give me hope by being my friend. Don't be so humble. Take a bow. I expect a full report over high tea soon. That is a date. date. Maxine, are you there? Are you okay? I just heard on the news about this art teacher you were always talking about. What is going on at Blackwell? I'm fine. Too much to text. It's crazy. I'll call you later. I hate you being away like this. Don't keep me waiting. I won't. We're so proud of you. Thank you. You know we always believed in you and your photos. Of course you did. That's why I'm at Blackwell. Warren, uh oh. He texts so much too. I know. Okay, so. So that's probably all the same. Yeah. I don't remember this. No. Like time, my texts are infinite, plus I have unlimited messaging. I'll make you a list of essential books and websites and movies. <laughs> going ape. ape. Going ape. We have to get supplies for the drive-in. Maybe we can have dinner first. Dot 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 or whatever. Yeah. Hey girl. <laughs> Max Jefferson W T F. Insane, right? Did you ever suspect him of what? He just seemed like a cool teacher. I thought you kind of crushed on him. Sorry. You should be. I admired his work. Not anymore. Yeah. Fuck him. He's history. Yes, he is. Do I have to make an appointment to see you now? Oh, please. But yes, you do. It's so cool that you won. Thanks, Warren. It feels weird. Is that it? And that's everyone. The beginning of the end for Jefferson and the Prescotts. Mm -hmm. So you would imagine that the Prescott development is going to, like, be halted? Yeah. Because of all this? Right. To Moon Diner, amid all the environmental chaos in Arcadia Bay, such as the unseasonal snowfall and beached whales, some residents reported seeing two full moons last night around 8 p.m. Witnesses claimed the double moons were clear in the night sky until clouds covered them up shortly after they appeared. No cell phone or video footage has, has surfaced yet, which has led local meteorologists to believe the that imaginations are in overdrive due to the recent eco-havoc. Blackwell Security uncovers bunker and scandal. Acting on a series of tips from David Madsen, head of security at Blackwell Academy, police officers descended Tuesday on a bizarre underground chamber, allegedly used by teacher Mark Jefferson and student Nathan Prescott to drug, kidnap, and photograph young women. Although there were no signs of physical or sexual assault on the victims, the disturbing revelations have sent shockwaves through the tranquil city of Arcadia Bay. Even Sean Prescott, the most powerful businessman in the area, is under investigation for his role as owner of the farmhouse where the high-tech dark room studio was located. Right. Okay. Aw, I haven't seen Hot Dog Man Hot Dog Man. Hot Dog Man. Chloe and I used to totally play the video game and watch <laughs> him all video the time. Game. Wow. <laughs> Can we play it? We were innocent. <laughs> Nothing with the whales. Please mm -hmm. shut off your phone, sir. I have to admit, I love being called an artist. It's pretty cool. Mm -hmm. It's so weird to be Whoa. in between realities. Everything is out of focus and in the distance. So, do we still have our powers? Maybe. Can't access them at the moment. In Frisco. Uh, nobody calls it Frisco, so please don't. <laughs> Anything going on? All right, let's take a look. I guess we're gonna use the screen. Watch a movie or something? We're almost in San Francisco. Oh, okay. I'm so, so stressed, we are gone. but yeah. I'm so excited too. Aren't we worried about that? Please fasten your seat and stow any electronic gear yeah. the plane is on the ground and at the gate. Thank you. We're starting our descent in a few minutes. How about it's a like, beautiful day in San Francisco with clear skies and cool Bay 60 getting degrees. Wiped out. We hope you enjoyed your trip, and we thank you very much for choosing Pacific West Air. Come fly with us anytime. Uh, I don't think so. Wait. I'm hoping these airline seats get smaller so I won't have to fly at all. But what if something happens on the plane? Wait a second. Do you huh. Wait, so what's going on right yeah, now? Yeah, we're not. We're still, like, in between. Are we not? So how do we? Wait. Should these seats be any smaller? So we're not current. Get away with it. It's not a current 
I guess when we started this whole thing, a from a time's show. point of view, we're why, not there why, yet. Why? Be careful. Wait. I'm still between realities. Oh. And Wait, I'm confused. So, like, I think this is hap- How did we get here? Like, when are we- when was- when do we go back to present day? I guess we're not in our present day from when we started this, then. Like, before when we did this, when we went into a picture and changed things, we- when we left, we were back right at the right time. Yeah, but I guess not this time? Is it because- no? Is it because we went picture in picture? So that, like- Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, I'm confused. Fuck this. Let's see. I bet this is a nice break for Principal Wells. After all the damage control he had to do this week at Blackwell. How did you sleep? Hope I wasn't snoring out loud, Max. Just a bit. It's been a tough week at Blackwell. So I hope you'll forgive me. Between Mr. Jefferson and Prescott's, things have been hectic, to say the least. I totally get it, Principal Wells. That's a smart way of telling me to stop whining. <laughs> we are proud of you for representing Blackwell at the Everyday Heroes Contest. I know I'm not exactly the guide you wanted in San Francisco, but we all want you to have a great experience here. I already am, and we're not even there. Yeah. <gasps> uh -oh. Christ. Another nosebleed? That's quick. Max... You're not just screwing around with time. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. So instead of being there... Okay. Oh, so it's like right... Okay. Okay, it was the other picture, I think. Yeah. Got it. Now we should be fine? This is present. Yeah, now we're like... Yeah, we should be fine. Whoa. Art. Francisco is so cool, and this gallery is huge. So is the buffet. <laughs> if an event <laughs> skims on food, <laughs> you know it's a bad event. As long as I don't have to eat any caviar. This is your day, Max. You can do whatever you want. I hope you take advantage of your status and talk to as many influential people here as possible. Oh. Work the room. You got it. I don't know. I, I feel so weird, like I'm a little kid hanging with the adults. Max. After this week, you are certainly not a little kid anymore. In fact, you're a noteworthy adult being honored by your peers. Now you have to start acting like the photographer you want to be. Mm. Hell, I wanted to be in charge of a big school someday. So I started taking charge of things when I was young. <laughs> Ask my poor classmates. <laughs> Max, I'm gonna eat up that caviar so you don't have to. <laughs> uh, better nice. get in there and start schmoozing. You know, I won't always be here to take charge. But you come talk to me whenever you want. Wow. Principal Wells isn't so bad all the time. After everything that's happened, this should be the least scary thing you've ever done. Alright, I have a lot of walking around to do. And schmoozing as well said. Any more text messages since we landed? No. Sir Max, you did it. Somehow. I went yes. from the dark room to this gallery. I've been through so many realities in one week. <laughs> Life is weird. <laughs> Life is strange. Oh, that would have been a perfect opportunity for it. Wow, sir. A Danny Lee article. Danny Lee. I left my art in San Francisco by Daniel Lee. Yes, I was born on a BART train. Literally. It's a long, amazing story that I won't repeat here. Drinks are required for that one. Here's to mom. That might explain my obsessive love for the Bay Area and its outposts of artists and dissidents. D 
Despite the rampant gentrification, artists and creators thrive regardless of socioeconomic pressures, because that's what they do. Galleries such as the Zeitgeist and Milkovich Fashion have engaged with the diverse community and practiced what some pa patrons only preach. Ooh. So many leaflets. Yeah. Too many. Ah. <laughs> Let me look. I love how much cool art is going on all over the Bay Area. Unlike Arcadia Bay. Shambhala? Some mysteries should stay that way. Kaltiki? Hey, there it is. That, 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 that looks like what's outside of school. Yeah. It does. I love how much cool art is going on all over what the Bay Area. Way? I wonder how it is to live in a submarine like that. No thanks. It must be really claustrophobic. The revolution will not be televised. Stop the startups. How many more shops and residents have to be driven out of their lifelong homes by the latest boutique cafe or overpriced theme restaurant? <laughs> the tech heads that have enslaved the city need a lesson in transgression. Ooh. To begin the end. Error, error. So what did I read? I don't think I... Oh. The bottom Holy shit. There we go. This flyer was designed just for Chloe. Skull and bones. I wonder if I'm ready for the mosh pit. Yes. <laughs> but what would I wear? Fun. What's that one on the floor? On the bottom right here? How fun. Yes. Warren would definitely go ape over this show. Dystopian cinema. Blade Runner. The Hunger Games. <laughs> fun. Okay. Can we talk to this lady? The receptionist. Oh, art books. The Zeitgeist Gallery does have a cool history in Frisco. Frisco. Uh, I mean, San Francisco. Wow. She's so <laughs> hip. I wish I had time to go see those murals here. I never thought I'd get to speak to a gallery receptionist about my own work. Nice. Nice Why, good morning. Indeed. You must be Max Caulfield. Congratulations for your everyday heroes <laughs> photo. Rewind. The exhibition is quite impressive, especially with your entry. Oh, thanks. Why, good morning. Okay, you must it. be Max Caulfield. Bye. Congratulations <laughs> for your everyday back heroes. Anything back photo. here? Staff the exhibition only. Is quite impressive. Damn, I'm sure something. Especially with your entry. All right, let's walk Wait. in here. What? Donation box? Or did you already look at that? Donation box. Yeah. Oh, I, oh, I think it, maybe because she was talking. I need to drop some serious cash in there. Give the gift of art. Donations go straight into community art programs. Okay. Was Good. there something back here? Damn. Well. Who are you? I thought I was supposed to schmooze. <laughs> there I am, along with all the other winners. Whoa. So I should cool. say artists instead. Artists. That's right. Are you an artist? What is a hero? The Zeitgeist Gallery is proud to be a participant in the 2013 Everyday Heroes National Contest, a showcase for today's future stars of photography. The winners, chosen by prestigious teachers from art schools and programs across the nation, reveal imaginative skill and heartfelt awareness which highlight the casual heroism of those who may never appear on the news or reality shows for unrecognized deeds to the community and beyond. Celebrating each young artist and their work is as important as their celebration of our all too often invisible everyday heroes. Yeah. That's a nice message. Yeah. Cool Whoa. light fixture. What do you guys think? Hey. Are you Max Caulfield? Bravo well, you on know your me? <laughs> I'm the art critic for Iris N Magazine, and we would love to include you in a piece about future trendsetters in photography. That's yes. I'll send that's... you the details this week, if that's okay. Absolutely. Congratulations for your piece. That sounds like Jefferson's voice actor. We didn't even have to say anything. <laughs> wow. Dang. Oh. Look. Not my style, but the neon is a nice representation. Oh, shit. Pretentious alert. <laughs> I love a good neon. Anything around the corner? Oh, what's over here? Look at this print. The <gasps> Hot Dog Man. Field, the colors. Look at the bulk of shape. 
This was definitely shot with a medium format camera using a Leica 35mm lens. You can definitely find out those details. The story of a photo <laughs> if you know how to look at all the details of a picture. Oh, this is so interesting, Matthew. I didn't think you knew about all this. When I was younger, I did a lot of photography studies. Didn't I tell you about it, Emma? I was quite good at it, actually. But I decided to drop photography to do a real paying job. <laughs> anyway, it is interesting to be here, and you're lucky to be with me here. I can share all this with you. Uh, Dad? The label says that this is a print from a disposable camera. What are you talking about? Uh, yes, of Exposed. course. I was meaning a Leica disposable camera. Yes, yes. Uh, and don't contradict me anyway. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> That's so funny. So is Hot Dog Man the everyday hero? Yes. Firefighter. Be cool, Max. Smile and Runners. don't say anything stupid. Nah, the, the other guy just did, so Grandma. you're good. <laughs> oh, what's in here? Looks like some black and whites. It's great to read all these comments. Even the mean ones. So inspiring. Not as good as last year's show. Wow. Makes me want to start taking photos. The future of photography starts here at Lisa Simpson's. These heroes <laughs> chose the path of least regret. A great example of total surveillance. Their 15 minutes are almost up, John Doe. Thanks, this is so nice. Inspiring stuff, Steve. Wow. Okay, let's check out this little room. Woman. Hey, I like your hair. Aren't you from Blackwell Academy? I wanted to go there, but I didn't get in. They have such a cool program. I bet you're oh, learning right? a lot. Not from the right people. Aren't you from Blackwell okay, Academy? I wanted to go there, but I didn't get in. They have such a cool program. I bet you're learning a lot. Here's and then cool. some. Statue. That one is kind of silly. I like it. Mm -hmm. it looks like he's creeping. I would love to have this on a shelf. Someday. A lunch? I like. Oh, but imagine how much time it takes to make one sculpture. Mm. I guess that's why they're here. Yeah. This one feels special. Mm-hmm. It's nice. Perhaps a couple, an old couple. That too. All right. It's a bit empty in here. I feel like they could have utilized the space a little yeah, better. Yeah, a little bit better. What do I know? Okay, I looked at that. Upstairs. What do we got going on? Hello, sir. How do these galleries afford to rent here? I don't know. Don't ask us. No. <laughs> Dog, Dog my baby. Okay, Wells is, we wanna stay away from Wells right now. Yes. Wow. Who are you? Hanging out at the snack? Food. Ooh. Caviar. Hey, you're bucking the- <laughs> His body I guess I have me. to get used to the idea of fancy food I don't want to eat. Is it like cheese and crackers? I guess so. Wow. I know it's kind of simple, but I find this haunting. Right? The instant print makes it look timeless. Anyway. Nostalgic melancholy. A Who's teenage the girl. Artist? I think it's for some contest. That's cool. Seems pretty mature. Oh, hey, you're the one who entered the self-portrait. Or actually, do you call it a selfie? Anyway, I was very impressed about how you subverted it to make all of your photo subjects the focus. Oh, very smart. Thank you. Thank you. What a compliment. Like, I do not understand art. <laughs> I feel like you took a similar photo like that yourself. Oh, yeah. I have. Man. Well, I have to say, this is the best everyday hero show I've seen since it began. All the pictures say a lot about our times. Bravo. Huh. Interesting. <laughs> I feel like the voice actors all just were like, you know what, let's just have some fun with a photographer this part. now. What's that supposed to mean? Volunteer. Is our photo back here? Yeah, we gotta find it somewhere. That is different. 
loving the retro vibe. I always get so inspired whenever I come here. That's great. Hey, I love your shot. I just wanted to say congratulations, and I hope you get a lot more attention. Thank you. Everyone has had nice things to say so far. Yes. Bird. This makes me feel so sad. Like I was back in high school. <laughs> Usually these That's kind of contests, they they put me to sleep, but I like how this show is about specific actions, you know, not just abstractions. The zeitgeist is doing some unique stuff this year. That sounds like Frank. Glad you think so. Okay, we saw you already. Where is our I thought we, we can sit over there. Uh, or we can sit. Oh, there yeah. it is. This is our shot. Where? Right there. Oh, right there. Okay. God, I love art. You must be the everyday hero from Blackwell. My name is Lauren Francis, and I run the media department at Ooh. Detroit School of Visual Arts. I'd love to talk about you being a residency next spring. Wow, Don't that's say great. anything to Principal Wells yet. Okay, okay. Detroit. I'll keep it between us for now. I wonder if I can buy these everyday heroes pictures. Can you? Do you want to buy mine? Sorry, yeah. I don't know your name. But I saw your picture in the gallery brochure, and uh, I just wanted to let you know how cool your entry was. Thanks. You want to pay me, like, I don't know, $5,000? $10,000. One million dollars. Okay. <gasps> Journalist! Okay, we talked to him. Take a look at these. <laughs> Wow, some great entries. Yes. Well done. Everyone did a fantastic job. Hey, Mr. Journalist. So, uh, do you like that picture over there? Hi, excuse me. You're Max Caulfield, right? Um, yeah. Yes. Sorry to bother you, but my name is Danny Lee, and I'm with the Berkeley People's Herald. I edit their art Magic. section, and I totally dig your work. Now, I know the whole ironic selfie thing is kind of played out, but there's something... Timeless about your images, so I, I'd love to set up an appointment or, or interview with you when you get a chance. Uh, here's my card. So great talking with you, Max. Wow, we're famous. You too, Danny. Nice. Hey, yo. Wow, oh, look at all these people standing around my picture. <laughs> okay, Three. Let's sit first. Reflect. I can't believe I'm in San Francisco. How can I process this after all the death I've seen this week? I wish Chloe was here with me now. Without her, I couldn't have fought Jefferson. And she always pushed me to not be shy about my photos. That's true. Even if that feels so trivial after what happened with Rachel. And Kate. But for whatever reason, I have this power. I hope I finally used it right. So far, so good. Yeah. Okay. And it worked out pretty well for us. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Absolutely. Hey, you are, Max. Hi, and there she is to save the day. Hi. Whoa. You did it, Max. You're a real artist. At least for today. <gasps> no. What? No. no. Oh, we still have this to worry about. Of course it had to be going too well. Yeah. Oh no. That is big, man. It almost looks bigger than before. Chloe! Hey, are you okay? We lost uh, you there for a second. Your nose. I'm okay. Uh, jet lag. High altitude. Oh, you left the ringer off, idiot. Oh, oh come on. Please answer. Max, holy shit, man, your vision. It's, it's true. You, you saw the tornado, it's coming. What? Oh no. Chloe, where are you? I'm so fucking scared. I'm, I'm by the beach. I'm, 
Holly, can you hear me? Hello? Oh no. Hello? Are we gonna have to change it? To like go to oh be my there? God. The tornado was real. Oh, I didn't fix shit. Chloe will die. Arcadia Bay is gonna be destroyed. Well then what are we supposed to do? Change to go, it again? There has to be a way to stop this. For good. It's back to the lighthouse. Something with the, with the lighthouse? So this all means we probably won't get this. Well, we still... I don't know. Do we have to go back to the picture? our picture? Maybe. What about Wells? Yeah, I'll talk to him. I'll see if I can talk to him really quick. No fucking way. Chloe can't die again. I have to save her. Hey, you know what? A quick way back? Well, is it just eating? Nope, we're just focused. Dang, this is gonna hurt us even more, I bet, though. Yeah, we're not doing well. How much would you pay for that? Oh my god. Here we go again. Dang it. Again. I haven't even got to take any pictures this episode yet. Excuse me, I'd love to ask you a few questions about your work. Sorry, but... We're kind of busy. Is it not gonna work? What if it does it? Uh... Is that not good enough? Oh, you're Max oh. Caulfield, right? Tell me what kind of instant camera you um, use. Can we talk later? Thanks. I literally do not have the time to deal with everybody. Can this work? I'm going in. <sighs> so, how do we stop this? So, at this point. Yeah, what oh, could we do shit. here? Oh, my head. <sighs> oh. What is, is going on now? Are we stuck again? It feels like reality is breaking apart. What am I doing to time? Nothing good. I just have to make one simple change so I won't end up in San Francisco. Rip the photo? Simple. Ugh. Wow. Is that bad? Could this... Uh... Sorry, San Francisco. Chloe comes first. Can we just still submit it and like not go? <laughs> so someone else wins? Victoria. Wait, that was Jefferson. Wait. What? Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? I thought we were done with this. We're Dang it. We're gonna be kill what, captured again? Oh, oh my fuck. gosh. Oh my god, no. I'm back here again? I thought I fixed everything. What did you say, Max? What? Jefferson should be in jail, not here. Jesus. It's like you're back in my class. You're still spacing out. It might be cool if you took one of your patented selfies now. The transformation between the old Max and the new Max. Anyway, answer my question, please. <laughs> Eat shit and die. Good answer. Good answer. Hey, your nose is bleeding. Probably gave you too big a dose. Sorry about that, Max. But considering you're about to die, a nosebleed is a first world problem. <sighs> oh my god. I thought we were done with oh. all this. I had to let Victoria Chase go. You let her? Don't be stupid, okay? She's exactly where she deserves to be. Also dead? No. Oh, 
as if you care. Well? Chloe is dead. Is it even worse than last time? Your iris, that dilation like a shudder. The pictures you're taking of me now. Too bad you pissed away your gift. You could have won the contest, but you destroyed your own beautiful photograph. What a waste. Sorry, I burned all your stuff. The diary. You got carried away. Fuck. He burned my diary. Always. That's why I'm still here. Especially since you've developed from nerd to hero within a week. There's something weird going on with you. Oh, this is the time of the storm? Whoa. <laughs> Did you see how crazy it is outside? Like I said, something weird. There's that fear. Oh, Max, it's an honor working with you on these final sessions. I hope these images will be appreciated for what they truly capture. The loss of youth. <laughs> At least, that's the last lecture you'll ever have to hear from me. Um... And I promise you. No more nosebleeds. Mr. What Jefferson, please, don't do this. You don't know what's happening. Shh, 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 shh. Quiet. Quiet, Max. Well, this sucks. <sighs> There's no photos. We have. We haven't. Please, don't do this. Is he about to kill us right now? I think so. Dude. No! No! Uh, I promise. No! This final dose won't hurt. No! What? <gasps> Who is it? Call. Say something, Max. Max. Say something. David. David. What? Help me! Oh. David, come on, bro! No, David! No! You've gotta be kidding me. Gee. Okay, why don't we say something? David's gonna come and save me. <laughs> oh. Is this fine? How far back do we have to go? I promise. This final okay. dose won't hurt. Can we say something? What? Oh, Warren. David, watch out! Time to shut the fuck up, okay? Oh! Okay, well, maybe we have to wait a little bit? Pat yeah. Time, Max. Yeah. Okay. Too early. And now. David, watch out! How? How did you know that? Did that. <sighs> okay. What? Is it. Too... Maybe still too early. I've looked up how to do this. I just ha can't quite figure out the, the timing. timing, maybe. So it's like when David's just David, in the room. Watch out! How? How did you know that? All right, to the left. <laughs> can I go? Is there anything else I can do? Before? What, what was this one? Do you remember what this was? I don't know. And I promise you. No more nosebleeds. Can you move Wait, something? Hold on. Can I can I please ask you for one last request? Is this new? Oh. You got me, Max. How can I deny that face? Wait. Was this like supposed to be before we got here? Cause we didn't have this come up before. No. One. Okay. Could any of these be helpful? Water. Turn off the lights? No, because then David couldn't see. Play some music? I guess that could make make it loud so he doesn't hear him. Or vice versa. David can't hear him. I don't know. Yeah, that's true. 
Water or one last picture? I'm kind of curious about the picture. Yeah. Would you uh, take one last picture of me? I, I want to be your best subject. I almost don't believe that, but I think you finally learned from So me. does this change something? Or do we... The saving? Oh! Wait, but our journal's burned. Oh, oh shit. Oh, weird. Wow. I don't think that's gonna help us, though. Although he puts the camera over there. Okay. I promise. About to come in. This final dose won't hurt. What? Wait. Can we use the camera somehow? David, watch out! How? How? How did you, How did know, you that? know that? You <laughs> get the camera next to you. Oh shit! Defeated no by his own. Weapon. No balls. Jefferson, it's over. You are not no. going to stop me. Get him, David. Ah. Uh, David Madsen. Of course. Wait, can we can we stop that from happening? Yeah. Me. Oh, wait, there's more stuff. What's what is there? You are not going Use to stop the table. Me. Kick that table. Yes, sir. <laughs> uh, Sorry, David. This is, what? This is going this is to stop? Me. Left. Oh shit! He gets to be fast. What? Yeah. Going to stop me? There you go, David. Hi. Right hook. There you go, David. <laughs> oh, Lord, Max, are you okay? Are you all right? Can you move? Yes. Make sure he's Thank you, like, David. actually knocked out. Thank you. Don't thank me. You brought me here. The test. Let's wrap up this son of a bitch first. I thought he was gonna. Yeah. There you go. Nice. He won't be going anywhere when he wakes up. So I wonder what happens with Nathan. Except you are now. going to prison forever. Or worse. Like why? Mr. Why Jefferson? was it different? Now it's your turn to be captured in a moment. Save Chloe. He burned everything, including all of my photos. So this is it. Warren! Yes! I, I can use that picture he took of us. Warren? Wait, what? Shit! No signal. Oh, the selfie? Thanks, Mr. At the party? Jefferson. But you won't need this anymore. So, I wonder, why do you think that we ended up here again? Even though we still let David know... I don't know. Hmm, I guess it could be anything. Yeah. Good well, God. Just looking at that it's makes so me want to vomit. Well, that was crazy. <laughs> yeah. My journal. Oh no. I'm glad I read everything then. Wait, can you read? Oh. Because it's all burned up. We need to get it back. And hey, we oh, have texts. Text. Max, thanks for kicking my ass to the party. I hang out with Brooke all night. She's so cool, and we're going to a gallery this weekend. So remind me to always take your advice. Okay, that's good for today. <laughs> Max, have you seen Chloe? She's not here and won't answer the phone. If you're with her, please tell me. Then I can leave you alone. At least let me know if you're getting these messages. Please, Max. Yeah. Have you seen Victoria? Oh, that's right. She's still dead. So do you think he killed Nathan as well in this? Maybe. She vanished after she got her award. I saw you talking to her, so I thought you might know. I'm a little freaked, so please hit me up if you see her. So is it my fault if she's dead? Because I warned her? That sucks. I don't know. Can we go? Well, we're going to go back in time. Oh, that's true. 
Um, yo, yo, where, where are you, Maxwell? Seriously, just tell me to piss off. Max, now I'm worried. I'm leaving the party to find you. Sorry. <laughs> I hate when they do that. Sorry. sorry. I'm sorry I'm like this. <laughs> <sighs> I want to burn all these photos. Mm. I hate looking at me like that. Yeah, it's messed up. Bracelet. The press oh. gods had to know about this. That's... Victoria's bracelet. I bet Jefferson was going to use that to frame Nathan. Ah. Chair. I can still feel those straps. Stop, Max. Max. You're free. I'm sorry you had to be here. Listen, David, I know we've had our differences, but I do appreciate so it. So gross. I wonder if he charged that duct tape to Blackwell. Mm. Scumbag. Jefferson looks so no. pathetic now. What the hell is this place? David Madsen is on the case. He's still looking for evidence. David? Are you okay? Look at this place. It feels like hell. Jefferson was... was going to kill me. Like he did to Victoria Chase. Oh, no. I always suspected that son of a bitch. <laughs> Everyone's a suspect. Listen, I'm not gonna crap on him now yeah. while he's. You know, I never did. Us. Until too late. You shouldn't have to suspect your teacher. He wasn't a real teacher. He just wanted to lecture. It was part of his sick plans. I wasn't surprised when you accused Nathan of drugging Kate Marsh. I thought so too. And Max, I treated Kate like shit. I know she's a good person, but I'm not. I hope I get to tell her that soon. Okay, so now he's coming, coming clean a little bit. That's good. I mean, Kate was bullied by a lot of people. Yeah. Uh... Kate was bullied up to that roof, but it was still Nathan and Jefferson who put her there. I knew Nathan Prescott was a threat. I just waited too long to neutralize him. Jefferson already did. They had some weird father-son thing going on. But Nathan killed Rachel, and Jefferson had to use him as a scapegoat. That pervert was pulling all this open. shit right under my nose, too. I could have stopped him and Nathan if only... I wasn't so stupid. No. I told Principal Wells Nathan had a gun and I almost used it, but he didn't want to believe me. I should have been more loud. We all make decisions we regret, but I have to admit I'm impressed by you and Chloe and your investigation. I had all the high-tech toys while you had each other. Oh. Wow. She learned from you? We're a great team. We... We are a great team. That's one of my problems. I'm not good at teamwork. Never was. Even in the service. I can't even imagine what you went through. I'm not going to make any excuses for my behavior. I tried to be a good soldier, but I wasn't so great. I tried to be a good father, too, but when Joyce kicked me out, I had nothing. I'm I'm sorry that it all turned out that way. Yeah. I'm so sorry about that. I didn't want that to happen. I should never have set up those surveillance cams. I kept all those files. I'm going to tell Joyce I was wrong about you. She does love you. It's pretty obvious. I try not to use my service as an excuse, but... It's hard to come home after war. Most people don't know or care what it's like. Except Joyce. She gave me hope. A new life. And you saved mine. Chloe, is she? She would be proud of you. I just want to see her safe with her mother. I promised Joyce I would go see a family counselor. Okay. That was a start. Uh, I'll start by apologizing to Chloe. Okay, that's good. I don't expect her to call me dad, but 
Maybe she'll stop calling me step douche. <laughs> so where is Chloe? Uh, tell the truth? What is the truth? That David. she's down by the beach? Uh, Chloe is... is dead. Oh, oh, we're right, right, we're in this timeline. Yeah, this so is it's... Happening. I forgot. <laughs> it's you hard can't. to remember everything that's going on. No, God. Not Chloe. Max, are you are you sure? Are you Yes, I I saw her. I I saw a Jefferson killer in the junkyard last night. Last night? When I was feeling sorry for myself in my hotel room. Damn. I promised Joyce that I would protect her and Chloe. How can I face her and explain this? I never even told Chloe that I... I... God damn it! You killed my wife's child, you sick fucker! And you took away my stepdaughter! He's gonna kill him. David, wait! Max, I'm sorry. I'm sorry you had to see that. What a mess. What have I done? All that time I wasted with surveillance. Uh, Chloe, I'm sorry. Joyce, I failed you. You better not. My family. Right. You didn't fail. You did your best. Max. You better get outside. You've seen enough of this room. David, I, thank you for saving me. I don't think I like the way that turned out. No. Okay, let's try that again. Well, yeah, I know, it's tough. I mean, we're gonna go back again anyway, right? At least I, that's the hope. Yeah, I guess, I mean, we get some extra, like, I mean, it's, hard, it's a heartbreaking scene, so we learn really more about I know, I see what David. they're doing here. They're giving him his redemption arc. Yeah, it, it did, yo. It did. I but I appreciate that he was able to, um, you know, Apologize to yeah. us and admit his wrongdoing. I know. Well, guess we're gonna lie this time. David, um, she was pretty stressed out, so, um, she went to go, um, medicate before I ended up in here. So, she's okay. Oh, thank God. For once, I'm happy Chloe's a stoner. <laughs> David, I, I have to go outside and get some real air and use my phone. Of course. Go on, Max. Dang. You're a brave soldier. I'm glad Chloe has a best friend like you. Wow. On, what a... You've seen enough of this room. Two totally different vibes. Yeah, no Okay, kidding. teacher. Let's see what kind of photo evidence you shit all over this computer. I could have told David the truth. He deserves it. You're fucked, Jefferson. Well, I guess, like, in this reality, he'll find out eventually, anyway. Yeah. And if, if like, for some reason we couldn't fix things, like, if this was set, I would rather him not be a murderer. Go to jail for that. Go to jail. At least Sick have a chance for him to, like, be there evil. for Joyce. Right. 
No more fucking guns. Is that, so that's the gun. Nate got that from... Nathan got that from Jefferson then. It looks like. Because it looks like the mm. same gun. But... How could... Every song you hear in jail will be torture. You'll never be free again. Wow, oh, so, so many, many. names. Victoria's at the top. Rachel. Jeez. Frank isn't a bad person, but he can't be in denial about the drugs he provided. Heckless. Oh, Chloe. I'm gonna save you for the last time. You won't be going, Jefferson. To any more shows. That's so oh, weird. No. We're just there. Yeah. No. Nobody will look at Jefferson's work the same. Plus, I would rather have Jefferson put on trial and. Yeah. That just Looks ends. Looks like his, Jefferson was planning a major security renovation with Prescott Cash. No one would have looked for Nathan's body with this. Oh, I got a ticket for him? To you LA, right? Fly okay. for this. Jefferson had plenty of women who would have totally posed for him. Not what he wanted. But he didn't want to give his subjects a choice. Damn. Jefferson, you're lucky the cops are getting you in one piece. Almost didn't. Right. The camera. All this expensive gear just for sick bullshit. Well, I suppose it's time to get out of here. Yeah. Let's see if we can. God damn you. Save Chloe again. And then the storm. And the deal with the storm. Oh, jeez. So now we're gonna get transported back to the party. Freedom. Holy shit. This storm is real. I need to find Warren. Quick. Where's Warren? He went looking for us at the party. He said. Come on, Warren. Warren. Can you hear me? <laughs> Never mind. Listen, do you have that photo you took last night in the parking lot? Yeah. But why? It wasn't that great a shot. Yes, it is, and I, I want it. Where are you? I'm at the Two Whales Diner. Pretty much trapped in here with Joyce thinks it's mm. Armageddon weather. I'm expecting the ocean to turn red. I'm on my way. Come on, that's crazy. You can barely walk on the sidewalk outside. Seriously, Max, stay wherever you are. Oh, well, we don't have a choice. Right. I'm kind of scared. That's okay. Me too. But it's not over yet, Warren. So hold on. Let's ride the storm. We gotta drive in this. Give me the wheel. I hope you have your license, uh, Max. <laughs> what if it's like, it turns into like a, a full-on driving? <laughs> Let's ride. This is right by where the tornado is. Yeah. Right by the bay. I trust Limbo have been warning you people for years that our culture of sin and entitlement would lead to God striking us down. And I'm the one trapped in this fucking radio station. Somebody get me the hell out of here now! Now, God damn it, hell this place You have one new message. Received yesterday at 9 p.m. From Chloe? Max, it's, it's Nathan. I, oh. I just wanted to say I'm sorry. Wow. I didn't want to hurt Kate or Rachel or, or I didn't want to hurt anybody. Everybody used me. <laughs> Mr. Jefferson, it's coming for me now. All this shit will be over soon. Watch out, Max. He wants to hurt you now. 
Dex. Mm. There it is. Sorry. Ooh. I guess that makes me feel a little bad for him. Yeah. In spite of the terrible things he did. Cars are on buildings. Whoa, what happened? Was that the tornado? It has to be. Oh, oh my, my gosh. gosh. Where's the diner at? Bruh. Can we stop the storm at all? I don't know. We may just have to like warn people that's it oh my god <gasps> that's crazy this damn storm I gotta find Ward oh my gosh Warren is at the two hills diner so hurry up where is it? I don't wanna die here. Can I help you? Hey! It's the trucker! Trapped. I have to help everybody I can. This I have guy. To get this guy out of here or he'll die. Oh, I got you. Lord. Thanks, kid. Are you okay? Once I get the hell out of here, I was trapped here because I got stuck in this shithole delivering logs after the Ah, it's my fault. I'm sorry. And I ain't never coming back here. You need a lift? No thanks. I have to find a friend. You go, girl. You go. Oh. Alright, so he's good. Dead, Dead body. Death is everywhere. It's following me. Jeez. It's over here. You guys good? Alright. Do you think I have any pictures to take here? Maybe. Oh, the well, right? Isn't there a well on fire? It's probably the sign. Oh, yeah. Anything else looks stormy? Oh, that does. There's a car on the roof. Oh, yeah. Alright, let's keep an eye out. I missed too many last time. Oh, that'd be kind of weird to take a picture during this. Well, there's a whale to the right. What? Are you a photographer? What? Wait. This will be my masterpiece. Is that? Run away, Evan. Get the hell out of here, Max. There's no way I can pass up these images. Just look at it. You can't take a picture when you're dead. Now move your ass. Okay, if you insist. Ooh. Whoa, Max. You do know things. Such an it's idiot. All over now. Only if you don't find a safe spot until this blows over. Okay? Now I better listen to the real everyday hero. Come with me. I have to help somebody else first. Shit. Oh, it's just eight. It's just a. I think an actual well. Yeah. Oh, what's this? Oh, I could just step over it. Okay. Um. So is the diner right here? No. No. It's further. It's hard to tell where I'm at. Yeah. Ooh. This sounds horrible. Is that oh, Alyssa? It's, it's Alyssa. I don't know who to help first. Shit. Alyssa needs help again. We did see her again. Oh my gosh, okay, we'll have Alyssa first. This is crazy. Girl, I got Help you. Down, Jump! Alyssa is stuck in that house. I have to get her out fast. Alyssa, are you okay? Let me help you down. Yes, yes, please, Max. Oh, 
I don't want to die like this. Find something to get me down. Do we need Please. like a plank or Help wood or a ladder? Bro, I would just jump at that point. Help me get down, Max. I'm trying. I don't see anything here. A pole. Oh, there was that pole. Oh, wait. This oh. is. Oh, wow. Okay. Wow. Trusty plank. Nice. Damn, yeah, Max is doing everything right now. Oh. Take my hand. That's like five. Okay. You did it, Max. Are you okay? We need to get out of here. Alyssa, you go on. I have to help other people. Watch out, Max! Ah, ah. Damn. That was close. Thank you, Alyssa. Alyssa saved me. Be wow. careful out there. I don't know about saving. Wait, what do you mean even? <laughs> Wait, what? Even from what? I've helped her way more times than she's on for you. If anything, you always, you always like six. I guess favorites. I guess that's the only time I've saved her life. Right. So. Eh. Okay, who's this? Who's this? It's a man. Oh, I can't stand seeing these bodies. Oh, so I guess I can't help them. No. Well, I haven't seen any cars on the roof. No. no. I can't cross this way. I saw through this building. Is there another way around? Oh, is he right? Yeah. Oh. Let's just take a look. Is this... Okay. Ooh. Where is this at? How can I get out of here? Fuse box? Fuse box. Flyer. This makes me so sad. Hmm. Oh, I hear someone over there. Right? Yeah, I had a crazy. voice. Sprinkler. Okay. I just need to switch on the electricity to activate the sprinkler. Okay. Hopefully this works. Don't fail me, fuse box. Hey, yo. <gasps> He's dead. Electrocuted. Oh, it's a fisherman! We heard a voice. I didn't think he would... I know, I didn't realize he was in there! I want to help that fisherman, but... He's in shock, and he might not hear me. How can we help him? Dude, I cannot kill him. What? Damn, I'm stuck here unless I put out this fire Can we, first. like, throw something at him? What's this? Magazine? Damn it. If we can make it out of this, Chloe. Road trip! <laughs> That's the last thing I'm worried about right now. Unless we do something after, like, we kill him, but then we move something. Rewind it. Ooh, good call, good call, good call. Alright, sorry, man. He'll be back in a sec, hopefully. I right, hopefully it doesn't like. So maybe we can move that electricity cable. Oh no! I got you. Give me a second. Give me a second. I'm not leaving. Is there something out here? Oh wait, can we rewind? Oh, we can rewind. Now and that we'll... we're in here. Yeah. Good thinking. Hey! <laughs> Come on! You have to get out of here right now! I need to breathe! Uh, I need air! Please, 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 please. But. Okay, yeah. so now he's moved. Wait, no. From that spot. Well, if I rewind, he'll go back, won't he? Will he? Because I can't leave. Yeah. Yeah. So. Oh, I can oh. use it from here. Perfect. You 
You should get out of here. The whole town is dying. Okay. I better hurry to the diner over here. I need Warren's photo. Red binders. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, let's get out of here. There's a diner, I think. Yeah. yeah. Oh my gosh. Yo, what if Warren is out? Die. Nice. Alright, where are my photos? Oh my gosh, oh. that should be a photo? Yeah. That's crazy. Oh my gosh. Oh. Wow. We gotta hurry up and warn everybody. I don't but... have time for pictures. Oh, it's this. It's that. It's like a gas trail. Oh, can we probably can't stop it, huh? I don't know. Sand? Maybe I'll just put, you know, so I have time. Use. Ooh. Now we can take a picture. Yeah. Jeez. It's the end of the world. <laughs> Let me take a quick little photo. Oh. That car is probably. Did I miss it? Maybe back there somewhere. I don't Look know. Tornado might be the end of the world. Oh, is that Frank's? <laughs> Frank's RV. Yeah. It. Have a nice day. <laughs> sure, but somebody has to save the world. I've... I feel entertained. Oh, huh. uh, is that car anywhere? Oh, oh, there it is. Nice. How do I get you? Oh, is it the... Oh, no. Officer Barry. He died before I could help him. It's too late now. Dang. Hmm. The monsters are actually the people here. Horror movie. Oh, I was just talking about the weather. Yeah. Hmm. Alright, Rick, what do we do here? Do we just need the angle on it? There it yeah. is. Whoa. There Dang, you go. That's crazy. That's like that's a nice touch that Jefferson's is a different format. You know? Oh different camera. Yeah, 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 yeah. Very small. Hey, what about like my lady is she here? She's is not she here. Oh, She's not here. Okay. I hope she's in a shelter. I never even asked her name. Sophie didn't warn her. Yeah, she'd probably be dead. Yep. All right, let's get in here. Hey guys. So Joyce Warren, who else could be here? Frank. Evacuation. Once again, this is not a test. This is not a test. An E6 tornado warning has been. At least nobody's going to starve in here. The emergency broadcast. Trust me, I'm trying to figure out how. I swear. System is now in effect. Go get him, Juliet. Blackwell bullying? As a student at Blackwater Academy, I'm torn in writing this essay. I love my school and the education it has provided, but at the same time, I have to use my own critical thinking abilities as a budding journalist. So when I report that Blackwell has a problem, it's not with any glee or agenda. In fact, this problem reflects a disturbing national trend. In short, there are bullies at school, and they are us. Wow, so she got it in the newspaper? Like, the main newspaper? I guess so. Alright. Oh, crawl? Oh, door. Can't do- oh. No, Warren! 
Frank. Oh, Max. Oh, Jesus, I am so glad to see you, sweetie. Are you okay? Yes. What about you guys? Four. Two whales is barely standing now. I don't know if it's gonna make it through this tornado. Oh, poor Officer Barry and all those people out I know. there. Okay, get your ass inside. I have to get back to this gentleman on the ground. Lauren has been gathering all the first aid. It's not much, Joyce, but it's all we have. You okay, Warren? Do you have the photo? How the hell did I ignore all those warnings, Max? The snow? The eclipse? There's nothing you could do about it, Warren. I'm so stupid. I should have seen it coming. Aww. So Aww. glad everybody is safe here. Um, but I need that photo from Warren to help Chloe. Okay. Sorry. Sorry. No more music. No, no, I'm just a pussy. The party um, is over. This vortex is much bigger. It's hard to believe people were eating breakfast here only a few hours ago. Sid! Oh, Pompadour! Pompadour's here! At least Aww. Frank still has Pompadour <laughs> by his side. He's alive, that's good. Well, let's ponder things for a bit. Are we gonna have a moment with Pompadou? Ah, Pompadou. Max, give yourself one moment to do nothing. This is where I convinced no. Chloe I could rewind time. So, what's the point of this power? What's the lesson? To keep fixing what I keep fucking up? No, because I didn't ask for this gift. But I, I was able to stop Mark Jefferson. And now I, I can stop Chloe from dying. For the last time. Damn. I mean, it does feel like we're close. To getting it right. Yeah. Thanks, Papa Do. Good dog. Come on, Joyce. Focus on the people here. What up, Frank? What's going on? Oh, it's just good to have Frank on our team. Los Angeles too. He could have been dead. Joyce has got everybody's back. Even Frank's. Okay, Max. Excuse me while I go help this other gentleman. Frank, I'm so glad you're here. Yeah, it makes two of us. Now, if only I had Rachel back. Now, Max, what about that info I gave you? Did you and Chloe find out what happened to her? Unfortunately, I'll yeah. give it to you straight. Yeah. Oh, Frank. I don't know how to say this, so I just will. Rachel is dead. God, no, please. Please, no, no, not Rachel. She can't fucking be. Are you, are, you, are you sure? I mean, how do you know? We used the names you gave us to track down a farmhouse. My professor, Mark Jefferson, has this creepy photo torture room. And we found out he was using Nathan Prescott to drug and photograph Blackwell students. Prescott? Fuck! Fuck, I knew it! I should never have hooked up with that sick punk! Papadou hated him! Yeah. You saw... You saw Rachel. Yes. Yes. I wish I didn't. I'm so, so sorry, Frank. Nathan wanted to impress Jefferson and he... He killed her. How? Hmm. The same Ooh, the drugs guilt. that the same drugs that he used. Now, now this, could this help him turn his life around? Well, we're gonna go back in time anyway, so does it even matter? There's another way it can go two ways, right? He feels so guilty, and he ends up doing something crazy. Right. 
Um, or he, this could be like a turning point of his life, like maybe I should stop doing this. He used some drug and gave her an overdose. An overdose? The only way Nathan could have done that is, is if I sold it to him. I killed my lioness. No, what have I done? Where is this motherfucker Jefferson? He's going to jail. He won't be hurting anybody anymore. Rachel, oh God. She was the one good thing in my life, Max. I know she was too young. I expect her to leave me, just, just not how it happened. I would never have stopped her from going after her dreams. I know. She obviously cared about you, Frank. You know, Rachel cared about a lot of people. Especially Chloe. But, uh... Now I see why Rachel dug her. And Chloe was man enough to ask me for help after all that shit we went through. Chloe would appreciate that. You know, the one time I met my dad, the bastard quoted the Bible and said he wanted to enter his house justified. In other words, to do the right thing. Me too. Hmm. And maybe you're helping me get there, Max. Okay. Wow. Don't get me wrong, kid. I still think you're weird. <laughs> but you're cool. No. That was hey, a good conversation. Frank. Do you think this is the end? Come on, Max. Let's talk over here. I'm, I can't tell her about Chloe. Some rest in space. <sighs> Joyce, how are you doing? She's gonna ask Just if I know where she is. I've already been through the ringer. Where's Chloe? <sighs> um, she's safe. She's safe, Joyce. She just sent me a text before my phone died. Oh, thank God. I was torturing myself before you showed up. Oh, God, if something happened to Chloe while well, I ended up stuck at this diner again. I'm sorry about uh. all this, Joyce. Don't be, honey. It's not like you whipped up this tornado on your own. Um, I mean, I'm also sorry about everything with David. You don't have control over any of that. David is an adult, and he has a lot more age and experience under his belt. And if he doesn't always show it. Um, I'm sorry I caused so many problems with David and Chloe. You did the right thing. David overstepped his bounds. I had a suspicion he was taking his private surveillance way too seriously. But he's sorry. I wish he was here right now. I just want our lives to be normal again. With all the shit going on this week, I think you're right. This has been a long week, me. man. Yeah. I'm trying to keep my family together. <sighs> Max, did I make a mistake kicking David out? Well, no. That's... I don't know how I feel about either of these options. David needs you. I mean, kicking him out is one thing. Completely ending the relationship is different. Yeah. What? If, that's your choice. I don't know. I mean, I guess I'll support David this one time. <laughs> David saved my life from the storm. I saw how much he cares about Chloe, even if he couldn't show it. The therapy is a David good idea, needs though. You more than ever. And I can see why you love him. I'm so happy David was there for you. He has a lot of weight on his back from the war, but he truly wants to help people. He even agreed to take a family counseling class. I'm sure that was a hard thing for him to do. It shows how much he truly cares about you and Chloe. Nothing would make me happier than for David and Chloe to make peace, not war. I don't know what to do anymore. I just, I just want this storm to blow over forever. Maybe it's time we leave Arcadia Bay. Oh. If we can. David is a real hero, Joyce. I know that all he wants to do is make you happy. 
I know he would do anything for you. And Chloe. I know. And yes, he's not William, but that's okay. He's not supposed to be. You reminded me of when he came into my life. I was ready to give up. David's love gave me strength. He even told me I was his hero. Wow. And I can't give up loving him. I want him to come back home. Oh, I hope I get to tell him that soon. Wow. All right. All right. Next up, we have I our buddy Warren. Escape the two whales. Pompadour. Good luck, Pompadour. I wish I could pet him. <laughs> as long as I have my Pompadour with me. Hey. Anything else over here? What's good, Warren? Just this in the building. <laughs> yeah. Jeez. What's this? Good job, Warren. I hope those supplies are enough. Look at Warren. Always trying to help. I hate to say I'm glad to see you. But I'm so glad to see you. That's okay. The important thing is that you're safe. And I know you can take care of yourself after Nathan. Should have done that a long time ago. <laughs> but damn, Max. Can't believe you actually drove down here in the middle of a fucking E6 tornado. <laughs> Just for one photograph? I mean, I know you didn't come for me. Oh. I came for all of you. Just tell me you do have the photograph. I just want... Now shut up and listen. Oh, yeah. You're finally going to tell me what you never did in the parking lot. Oh. I wish I would have. So I'm just going to tell you without any explanation. Trust me, okay? I always do. You should probably tell me quick. I had a vision in Jefferson's class of a tornado destroying Arcadia Bay. I went to the bathroom and saw my best friend Chloe get shot by Nathan Prescott. You with me so far? Where else could I be? Go on. <laughs> then I found out that I could rewind time. And long story short, Mark Jefferson is insane and dangerous. Whoa. Is that all? It's not funny, Warren. Um, you didn't I wouldn't say we started, started the storm. storm. We don't have proof of that, really. I have to go back in time. Oh, Jefferson what if she hears... Killed Chloe. Joyce... Don't avoid I can't this conversation. Let that happen. I have to do something, Warren. Max, going back in time is what caused the storm. Oh, because it is because of me. How? Do we I'm like disrupt things too much? Even though I play one at school, but this seems like pure cause and effect. Maybe chaos theory. <sighs> what happened with Jefferson? Did did he hurt you? So is it like the more that we rewind in time, that's why these things kept happening? Because we threw off the flow? Uh, so you think if we never rewind in the first place, the storm wouldn't have happened? Maybe. Um, he dosed me, but we're okay. Uh, Rachel was killed though, I guess that's more important. Nathan accidentally killed Rachel Amber trying to impress Jefferson. Nathan just needed mental help. And now he's dead. And Jefferson is done. Jesus, Max. I want the whole story, but... I guess we really are out of time. But I can still change things. What do you think will happen? For every action, there's... There's a reaction. Whenever you reversed or... Or altered time... Maybe you caused a chain reaction. Even in the environment. Yeah. More, more time together. What is that? I wish we had like a, I wish we had more time together. Warren, I know this all sounds insane, but you're the only other person who I can count on now. I wish we had more time together. Do you believe me? Max, of course I believe you. You're the most amazing person I've ever met. And I'm glad you trust me. Always. I just wish I could trust my powers. I guess we'll never know if it's magic or science. Even if it's from a wizard or a wormhole. 
like you're part of something bigger. Now, I don't believe in fate or destiny, but after this week, I realize I don't know shit. That makes both of us, Warren. I do know you're here for a reason. And I guess it's up to you to find out why. Max, I'm sorry you got stuck in this. In this, I don't have a fucking clue what's going on. But I have total faith that you'll do the right thing when the time comes. What's the right thing? I'm so proud of you, Max. Uh, I think be a more important moment in history. And I'm in the middle of it with you. So thank you for trusting me. It's always Thanks for there. being here. Always. There's a photo. <sighs> ah! God damn Please it. Be okay, Chloe. I can't lose you. Well, hey, be careful out there. What does this mean? What? Hug, kiss, leave. Just leave? That'd be so mean. Oh my gosh. It just sucks because, like, it doesn't matter. I mean, well, it matters to her, like, this Chloe, or this. To She'll, Max? To Max, yeah. I guess it matters to Max, yeah. Yeah. It feels like, I mean, at this point, it feels like a romance with Chloe isn't really, I don't know. <laughs> we're, we're pretty far <laughs> into the, this episode. I like Warren. Do we go for Warren? <laughs> I feel Leave. Like he's really, he, I feel like we've really seen a lot more of his character, like his inner character in the past couple of episodes. And it's been pretty cool. So. Let's do it. It's the end of the world. Oh, uh, yeah. For luck. Hey! <laughs> we kiss Chloe. We kiss Warren. Just in case we don't get out of this, I wanted to say. I know, Warren. Max's eyes look kind of crazy. Do. <laughs> no. I'm going to make the right choices from now on. I swear. That's why you're super max. Wow. I do like it. They do fit well together. All right. Okay, bye. <laughs> so we're going to be back at the party? So we just, I mean, I guess all we have to do is stop Chloe from... The tech, so... Or us from leaving. But... Jefferson will be there. Right. Everyone will be there for the most part, except for... Like, oh, but Nathan. he's killing... He kills Nathan tonight, doesn't he? At what point so does he do that? So how do we that? stop him from doing that? Oh, because that's he, he has his phone. Yeah, is Nathan already dead at this point? Maybe. Oh, back to this. this shit. Come on, Max. Chloe! <sighs> Chloe! Jesus, dude, what is up with you? I'm just glad we're here together. I guess you need to talk. No worries. It's all good. I'm glad you're with me too. What's going on, Max? We have to find Nathan right no. now. Wait, I'm sorry, Warren. Wait. To Rachel. Shouldn't we just Chloe, talk wait, about it listen. now? Yes. I can walk and listen, okay? Stop and listen for once. Fine, Max. I'm listening. Chloe, you can't go in that party. You're going to you're gonna die if you do. You used your powers, right? And you fucked around with time and I died. Not like that. You're supposed to back me up. So there's no way that punk ass bitch Nathan Prescott is taking me down. You're right, he won't. Mark Jefferson killed you and others. Jefferson, the art teacher? That's bullshit. Nathan is the fucking serial killer. We saw the proof. Now, excuse me, I'm going to that party no. to make sure he never hurts anybody again. Are you coming? Nathan is dead? Probably. Nathan is dead, and you're in danger. That fucker is already dead? How do you know that? The time because thing. I was there. Will you please tell me exactly what happened? Please. Jefferson killed him. Jefferson hurt me. Jefferson is a psychopath. Jefferson is a psychopath? I mean, I feel like that encompasses everything. Yeah. Mark Jefferson turned out to be a psychopath. Okay, Max, let's go in there as a team and take his ass out right now. 
Hmm. Don't leave me. Let the past go. Don't leave me? Yeah. Chloe! I should never have run away from you like I did when we left Arcadia Bay. I know I hurt you. All I ever wanted was to make it up to you. Please don't run away from me. Max, I'm not running from you. This is when I need you the most. This is how to make everything up to me. With your power and my gun, nothing in the universe can stop us now, Max. No, not this way. Chloe, I, I can't keep fixing everything if mm. all I'm going to do is just break it over and over again. I know how this is going to turn out, and I'm afraid I'm fucking up all these alternate realities. Wait, alternate realities? <gasps> what do you mean, Max? What did you do? Oh. I bought her and the dad, for sure. Uh, well, it's, I mean, it's everything, I guess. Yeah. Terrible choice. Do we talk about this? I don't know if that's a good idea. <sighs> I know it's a weird time to do it, but. Chloe, I'm, <sighs> I'm going to tell you the truth, no matter what. I changed your past, and I... I, I had to make a terrible choice, and I, I... Max, please tell me. I won't be mad at you. I don't I know. You can't say that. Back in time to the last day William was alive. I stopped him from leaving, but... But you ended up in a car crash instead. You saw my dad again? You... You were completely paralyzed. And... You, you were in pain. You were slowly dying, and you you asked me to end your life. I did. For you, I, I didn't want you to suffer in any other timeline or reality. I, I, I couldn't bear the thought of you in any more pain. God, Max. That must have been... That must have been awful for you. I... I'm so sorry I had to ask you that. It was worse for you. But I had no idea what would happen, and as usual, I messed everything up, and... I never want to hurt you. Ever. You have to believe me. Of course I do. Okay. Do you think I would even know how to handle like that honest, situation? Honesty was a good choice there. Nobody would. The important thing is that we're together again. You're right. That's, that's why you should come with me, so we can stay together and stay alive. I hear you, Max, but do you think we should let Jefferson get away with torture and murder? No. Of course not. If we tell David, he'll believe us and he can actually stop him. Right? I don't get it. Why do you trust him after you totally reamed him the other day? He's mm. not even at our house anymore. <sighs> um... David saved me, or David cares about you? I don't know if she would believe that. Right. I think if we show him that he did a nice an, an act of... Yeah. Chloe, David saved me from Jefferson. If he didn't track down the dark room, I'd be dead right now. Max, I had no clue. I should have been the one to save you, but I'm so grateful David was there. Okay. So what's your plan? We tell him everything, including that Victoria is in danger. Okay. You've been through so much. I, I believe you, Max. Was that a test? After all, I'm still your faithful companion. Would, it could be. I wonder if that was so something listen, I had to navigate. In a few minutes, I won't know any of this happened. Nothing. We absolutely have to stay in your room and do nothing. Then we explain everything to David, and we finally let him do his job. You'll have to tell me exactly what I did and said just now. Just... Explain that I traveled through time using the photo. Will you believe me? I'll always believe you, Chloe. Okay. Oh my gosh. <gasps> Whiplash. Jeez. Okay, so, so Chloe... Sucks for Nathan. Yeah, Nathan's already dead, it looks like. Alright. <laughs> they rumble... Instead of rumbling... Does he come there with the cops yep. this time? Nice. 
Victoria shouldn't have even been there, right? No storm. They're together in front of the storm. Can we stop it? <gasps> this is where we end up? Uh, what? Chloe! I see that the real Max is back. So, how was your time trip, dude? Shut up. Oh, you're alive. You're alive. Oh, both of us. <laughs> Maybe not for long. Did so much to bring you back, Chloe. It worked. Actually worked. But... With me again. Looks like even fate doesn't want us apart. And... Travel through multiple realities just to save my ungrateful ass over and over and I hope it was worth it, but I don't blame you for wanting me out of your life. What? After all my drama. Huh? No way. Come on. I'm the official drama king and queen of Arcadia Bay this week. Just look at what my powers have caused in just a short time. I'm nobody. You're a Max fucking Caulfield, time warrior. Even if you weren't, you're kind and caring. Nobody could have a better best friend. Nobody. You didn't ask for any of this to happen, but it did. You need to accept how awesome you are. Maybe I willed it subconsciously or something. I always wanted my life to be special and adventure. But not without you. And it, it didn't happen until I moved back here. So without you, my powers wouldn't even exist. And for whatever scientific, mystical reason that we'll obviously never figure out, we were meant to be together at this exact moment in history. Mm. I have to think that Rachel was somewhere behind the scenes, fighting for justice. I'd like to think that too. We all owe Rachel Amber. Now tell me everything that happened. You you remember, right? Well, we we left the party and made sure Jefferson couldn't okay. find us. For once, I was glad I lived in an actual fortress. Then the storm got hella crazy, and, and you said we would be safe at the lighthouse. Oh, oh we, we did? Look. The storm is getting bigger now. It's coming closer. Oh, I, I can't even believe this is real. This is happening because of me. Stop it. Is it stop beating yourself up, okay? We both paid our dues already on it. God, look at that. Look at that monster. Who knows? This could be Rachel's revenge. We're our so revenge. small. <laughs> yeah. The lighthouse is out of the way of the tornado. Come okay. On. So what could the lighthouse do? Is there a oh no. Chloe. Oh no. no. I've got your back, Rex. Oh great. Are we gonna be controlling Chloe? <laughs> that would be crazy. That'd be hella crazy. Will we get more answers on why we have this power in the first place? I don't know. <gasps> what? Alfred Hitchcock famously called no, no, film no, 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 no. pieces of time. I, I'm back in class. What the hell? Us. These pieces of time can frame us in our glory and our sorrow. Have to listen to this Jefferson lecture again. This might be hell. Now, can you give me an example of a photographer okay, who perfectly this is messed up. In black and white? Am I stuck in a What if we don't have our powers anybody? anymore? That would suck. Bueller? Diane Arbus. Be calm and you go, don't Bueller. freak out. Why Arbus? Yet. What? Because of her what? Faces, what the fuck? You feel like totally haunted by uh, the eyes of those sad mothers. Are we having a dream? She saw humanity as tortured, right? What's going on? And frankly, it's bullshit. Okay, this is definitely a nightmare. This is very weird. I, that is very disturbing. I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. Whoa. Everybody's gone now. Have I totally fucked up time? This doesn't make sense. Weird. What the? Are we like in limbo? That's me? Are you kidding? Huh? What in the hell? Am I still in here? <sighs> That's awful. Whoa. I think we're like in some nightmare thing. This is definitely <sighs> not for reals. Whoa. Do we have. 
Maxine, you keep fucking up. How many times does Chloe have to die in front of you? Maybe it would be better to actually, you know, have a life. Find my cat pics? The cat pics come back? My, my heart, heart is, is broken. broken. Take a selfie, ho. Yes, you're running out of choices. Let's all go to the lighthouse. Max, why do you want to kill everybody? What did everybody ever do to you? What is Bully. blood? What is Always take the shot. That's what Jefferson said. Yeah. This is getting weird. Do you have any text? We have surveillance video of you overdosing Chloe. You cannot escape now. There's no reality where you can hide. Don't you dare underestimate me, you hear? What? Wait, 1821. That doesn't even make sense. Yeah. I think everything's just messed up. Right. Pompadou. <laughs> Did we have a text? We had a text with Pompadou? Max, I loved your photo shoot with Jefferson. He acts absolutely captured you. If you want to, if you want, we can hang out and get high. Yeah, everything's messed up. Woof woof. Bitch, do not mess with <laughs> Frank or me. You got a snack? <laughs> this is crazy. Hi, Max. <sighs> Rachel Amber here. Just wanted to introduce myself. I'll be seeing you soon. Real soon. Good evening, young Max. The squirrels talk to me, but how can you? Samuel has no phone. Whoa. This is like some creepy purgatory, it feels like. It's very strange. Oh, what's this? That's nice. I you want to die. You didn't die, Kate. You're alive. Use. In a moment. That's the same. Right? Yeah. Can I actually leave? You might be able to. I'm not going to take the bait. I'm not. Everyday zero. Loser rubbish. So it's like all the stuff is kind of targeted at like us. Max. Rachel didn't deserve any of this. It's us burying, wow, not burying, but uncovering Rachel's body. Oh no. Is this like our own guilt? Or yeah. is it something more than that? That's what it feels like. Or just like our own. Yeah, I just you feel responsible for all this. Not yet, you bastard. Max, if you're reading this, it means you are dead. All Mr. caps. Jefferson. Oh, that's too creepy. Ooh. Yo. I mean, I'm half expecting Freddy Cougar to pop out. I know. Are we gonna have a chase scene in here, <laughs> running through the halls? I see you, Max Caulfield. Ah! Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. I just wanted to know if you'd like to spend the rest of your life in my dark room. Your purity inspires me so much. And we could be so happy together. Wow. Who needs selfies when I can give you portraiture? There's no way I'm saying that. No way. What? I love you. Thanks for killing Chloe. Our dark room. I guess we just do the less harsh one. My selfies are shit. Yeah. My selfies are shit. I need to be oh. framed by a real artist. I'm just a poser. Yes, you will be posing for me. There's so many angles I want to expose you with to the world. I hope you don't mind needles or duct tape. And he's uh, gone. This can't be real. I don't believe it. Weird. Can I leave now? Open. What horrors will we encounter? Everyone's gonna be dead. <gasps> oh shit! There's candles! Halloween! Is that Kate? Yeah. Yo, this is trippy. Yeah, it's very strange. Oh. Victoria Chase rules. Is she. praying for someone? Kate. Wait. Oh, it's her. She's We're not in purgatory, are we? <laughs> we might be. Hey, Kate. Max, why did you stop me from jumping? What kind of friend are you? She's behind us. You never understood me or what happened to me. 
Now my family will never leave me alone. And that means I'll always be alone. Thanks to you. Kate, that's not true. I've always been your friend. Whoa. Wow. Oh. We can't go to our room at all? Oh, we can't. Wait. Can we open any door? <gasps> Looks like it. Here we go again. What? Two nineteen max. Oh, a key. Oh, for what? Two eighteen. Whose room is that? <gasps> oh, um, is that? No. Dana? Hmm. But I didn't need... Whoa! Rachel Amber's clothes. <gasps> and Rachel Amber posters everywhere. everywhere. You can still look at the map. What? Rachel Amber's on here. Wait. Wait, Hadley... Victoria, Tara... Were these... No. Dana... I mean, there's a few different names. Yeah, strange. Are those the names of other victims? That's what I was wondering, but... Maybe. It might have been. I suppose we should go in Rachel, the Rachel Amber room. Yeah. I'll check it out just to see if there's anything different, but... Whoa. Did we do it? Whoa! Ah! Rachel... You suck. We are Victoria. 221. Okay. I hate Victoria. Victoria. Victoria's insecure. Victoria equals skank. Jeez. I know. Uh, this one, right? Mm hmm. Who are we going to be next? Back to ourselves. Oh, our room. Oh. All our photos. This is a cool little puzzle, but I don't really know where it's going. <laughs> yeah. Home sweet home. Look wow. Unbelievable. Rude. Wow, it's on everyone's? What? No. This is crazy. Grant. We're speaking devil tongue. Weird. It matters. Whoa. It's the very beginning. I love this song. <laughs> well, in rewinds. Am I walking backwards? Oh no, I can still walk forward. What? Ah, everything's backwards. Oh my gosh, this is horrible. This is fucking with my mind so hard right now. <laughs> ah! I hate this. Oh, this is disgusting. <laughs> ah! This is kind of crazy because... This was weird because at this point... We were last year, you know, we, we saw this right. scene. We were recording like a year ago, last October. So it just was even more crazy. I hate this. This is horrible. Hey, bro. Oh. 
Whoa, it's our dough! Our dough! Where are you? Are you leading me somewhere? I guess you fall. The so bathroom! Samuel! Ah! Get me out of here! It's still, it's still a vibe. Backwards. Where it all began. Whoa. Oh no, it's just a maze. Don't try to hide, Max. Get over here. Let me capture you. You're right. It's a chase scene. Bruh. Jefferson is coming after Max. me again. You used no. to be so pure, so innocent. Now, you have to die. No. We're in our San Francisco fit. Oh. And we're at the art gallery. Is it coming this way? Like, like coming, coming this way? Please understand, Max. Oh, I can't see. The you. only place oh I can be my selfie is be in the dark selfie. room. Okay, it looks like he circles around here. Okay. So it's just... What happened to your spark, Max? I thought I could be your Maybe professor. I'll be safe in the lighthouse. I... Maybe I'll wake up. Okay. <laughs> Move Guys, a little faster, Max. Now you'll never be an is he up ahead now? Much less a photographer. Shit. Come here, Max. Ooh. Class is dismissed. Oh, get out of here. Oh, shit. Oh, I can't go this way. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 loop no. Loop loop those days when you looked at okay, I thought, those I thought he was somewhere else. Eyes. Yeah, I thought he was like more in front of you. Yeah, me too. Again. I can teach you so much. Oh, gosh. Where are we? Oh, the school, the courtyard. Oh. Where am Look I? Look into the lens, Max. Turn right. Now left. Show okay. Me love. What do I... Can you just go straight ahead? No. Oh, gosh. I don't know how I get out of here. Oh, here. Don't Max. Oh, my God, Jesus. <laughs> Shit! I need to rewind and do something fast. Oh, nope, not here. Okay, put you back that shirt. I, miss those <sighs> I was not expecting that jump scare. Just those days when you Oof. looked at me in class with those wide eyes. So, I want to be your nice. Again. I can teach you so hey, yo. much. Ah! Well, look at the statue. Yeah. Oh, do I have to hide behind? Good evening, Blackwell. From the light? Maybe. And I'm here to drop the mic on Max Caulfield. Wow. I don't know if I have to, but... Miss Caulfield. I do. I have to rewind, now! Nice. Attention! I regret to announce... There you go. Oh, uh, Kate's photo. Okay. That one of your fellow classmates, <laughs> This is stressful. Yeah. What? Who's this? Max, where are you? Max, Warren. come out to play. Uh, excuse come out me? to play. But. It's Dark Warren. Hey, babe, babe. Who wants to go? Who's that? Go away, Could be Nathan. Go away, Where the hell do baby. I go? I found out it went through my wheels. How sick David Max is. Dig my wheels, Max. Get in the car. It's I'll everyone. They're just. Ride. Get in the car. Ooh. If only Kate Marsh would have jumped off that roof. Right. Could blame Miss. Let's get the fuck out of here. Finally, get her kicked out of Blackwell. Matt David. Bad so I can beat you up. <laughs> How can wow. I tell Max's parents that she's a nosy little uh, bitch? Okay, go on, left. Just nice. admit that you're jealous of my service record. The only admit it. You'll ever get in the vortex oh, shit. Club is if a tornado swallows your ass up. Oh. <gasps> Do you have a you scarf? You can't escape my Max? surveillance, Missy. Who's that ahead? You're just jealous because me and Victoria actually Shit. do the work while you do nothing okay. and whine. Damn it, Max! Wake up! 
Is that gonna... But that brings him closer. Well, you do nothing nice. and why? No, because it... Admit it, Max. Where'd he go? You're a stone. Is a oh, yeah. like Get there. Junk. Get your bony ass um, over here. Frank! I'm gonna cut you open, freak. This sucks. I'm Jefferson. Max. Max! Those were my beans, Max! Those were my fucking <laughs> the beans! The beans! They're back and Hardy goes forever! Oh no. Oh no. What? No, I, sure I can't move. You come back. We're buddies now. You can't move? I know you're dying for it. I can't move. Maybe we won't. Oh, no. Don't do this to me. Don't you do this to me, game. I don't want to have to redo this part. No! No! <sighs> can they come and... Maybe they can find you. Me and Rachel are floating down here like in the sewer. And on down. Yeah, capture us. They're, they're not only really, like, they don't move, they just follow a... <sighs> oh man, you should have heard Chloe smack talk you. Hey, I feel like the bugs have been worse than this episode. Yeah, I think the, the I feel like honestly the the longer we've gone, like the later episodes have, have had more of the bugs. Get out, get out, get out, get out. Okay. All right, we're back. I'm not gonna get close to the cars again, I guess. No. Bony ass over here. I'm gonna cut you open, freak. I realize now you'll never be an artist. Much Can less turn this a photographer. Come here, Max. Those were my fucking beans. Class dismissed. Will be my greatest turns. portrait, Max. Nice. We're going. I sure hope. If only you the could. The flashlights don't reach that far. Stop. Oh shit. I miss those days when. You Stop. No. Damn you, Nathan. I'm going this way. I miss those days when you looked at me in class with those wide eyes. What's this? What's this? I want to be my Can we? Bottles. This might be hell. Come on down. Wait, what? The ones that we shot at? Am I supposed to be collecting these? Stop right now! Too hard to find. Wait. Those wide eyes. Hey, Max. Why are we taking bottles? Do I need... I want to be your professor. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much. No. Looks like there are still bottles to find. Oh, joy. Wait, what? Is there stuff that I can be doing here? Max! You used to be so here? pure, so innocent. Chair, say it. You need to let me the last one. Oh, oh, our cat. Why would I sit here? I don't know. Max, sit down. You're taking a time out no matter what. This is my nightmare. Let me have one sanctuary. Amelia. Of course, this is where Chloe and Rachel used to hide from the world. <laughs> it's okay. Hey. But I can't hide for long. Whatever reality I'm in feels like a bad dream. It is. Yes. Am I just not learning my lesson? I don't know. Maybe your real lesson is to get out of this place. Okay. That's just a... don't be afraid, Max. Let them be afraid of you. Yeah. Welcome to hell. All right. It was brutal. Well, but of course, I see she what said she thinks we have all the bottles. Yeah. Okay, I'll follow right behind Frank. If you took some of my drugs, maybe you'd be a lot happier. <laughs> okay. So does that like unlock? Oh, photo. I need proof that bottles were out to get me, just in case. What? All that for a photo? Oh no. Oh no. Oh, I wonder, if, do you think there's something in the rewind? Well, there's a go ape locker in the, back there. But... There was? Can I even go back? Mm, it's not it. On. Dang. I said but get it, in the I, car. 
It could be anywhere. Did that get you hot when you saw me fuck up Nathan? I did. <laughs> this is so weird. What? <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> oh, uh... I would say this, this is my least favorite part so far. Of the whole sure. game, yeah. Hate Absolutely. The squirrels hate me. Mean Ray Max. No. <laughs> Let me go. <laughs> okay. Wow. If I missed a picture, then so be it. Bench. Any more thoughts, Max? Maybe we already had all our thoughts at the other chair. Maybe. Oh. Snow. Whoa. What? What a snow globe. Weird. It is weird. It's gonna shatter. Don't you dare question the chef. Right, like you're the real cook here. I am when your mom's away. I'll let her know that. This is so weird. Hello. Hey, honey. Just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the two wins. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Love you. Excuse me, ladies. I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. She don't have many bags of delicious grub for us you to feast upon. You are ridiculous. Uh-oh. You'll be grateful for that someday. I thought everyone was going to take us. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund. Ah! Please, please. Shit, where are those keys? Another dollar for the swear jar. You're bankrupting me. Aha. You can't hide from me forever. Now lock up after I leave. Play nice. Try not to destroy too much of the house. And no Chloe what? and Max. I got a one. message. From William. Hey. Whoa. Hey Max, would you say hi to Chloe and Joyce? Don't forget to remind them that you let me die. Tasting session. Dad. Ah, what's happening to me? Oh no, we're back in here. How long will this nightmare go on? Well, this sucks. I thought we were done I with this I think you'd room. be perfect for my new photo series on retro grunge. You have the same qualities that I loved in Rachel Amber, but not Max. Max is a fucking child. Oh, wow. Christ, I know. And she never shuts up, does she? Just get through <laughs> it, Max. I'm so over her hipster bullshit. I think everyone at Blackwell is over Max. Wow. Let's prove it. Holy shit, Warren. Max is trying to play us both. I guess she's not as innocent as she acts. No, I'm not. Not when she's trying to hook up with both of us. No. I only want to go ape with you, Chloe. Oh. Come here. Wow. God damn you, sexy bitch. Why hang out with Max, huh? Boredom. Plus, she's like my personal puppet. I hear that. Do you want a party? I got a drugstore in my room. Oh, shit. Look at Max spying on us. Take a fucking picture, bitch. Or take a selfie. See, this is how you bust a move, Max. No mosh pit for you, shaka bra. Damn, Victoria. You're a real woman. Not a little girl <laughs> like Chloe's hooking up with everyone. I fucking love your tats, Chloe. You're so hot. I can't believe it took us so long to hook up. <laughs> Why did you get rewind Oh, powers? no! You don't even know how to use them. Rachel's dead and you're still alive. Life yeah. is so not fair. I wish you would have never come back to Arcadia Bay. You're the real storm. Ouch. Not true. Are we at the diner? This looks like the diner bathroom. Yeah. Keypad. Keypad. We're locked. 
I'll be so grateful if this is the last digicode. Um. Well, we, I mean, we must need a clue. Oh, Wait. oh my god. Oh. What? Well, that's right. unfortunate. Numbers are all over the place. How will I find the right code? Sarah. Does it have... Well, that, that one's circled, but I can't really read it. 364? Oh, it's four digits? Oh, I didn't even... Yeah. Wow. I'm just doing a random one. What does this do? I'm not sure what that did. Right. Hmm. Maybe before all the numbers showed up? Can yeah. I go back? Why doesn't the mirror reflect any of the numbers? Oh, the mirror? Oh. Wow. So it's 0311? Good catch, Max. Wow, thank you. I needed your help. Open sesame. Don't kill us, Max. I guess I'll never dance again, Max. Right when I was about to start a new life in California. Who are you? I don't know. Are they all just people that like got injured in the, yeah. the storm or something? Shit, Max. Look to the right. Yeah, I thought we were on the same team. Oh, never mind. Now I'll die alone. What? Max, I hope you do the right thing. I hope. Whoa, there's a bunch of silhouettes out there. I guess I'll never dance again, Max. Honey, I always thought of you like a daughter. And now you're gonna take me away from my family. Why would you do that? Max, you're exactly the kind of soldier I'd want by my side in a war. Oh. Son of a bitch, this is gonna hurt. So this is how Max gets me. her revenge on. Now you're going to kill me? Max, please save us. Save the Bigfoots, Max. Please. <laughs> please. Please, bro. <laughs> so this is how Max gets her revenge on. Okay. Max, you saved my life. Gave me the chance to catch one more fish. Oh, that guy. Thanks for that warning, Max. <gasps> you treated me like a human, not like trash. That's good. I sure hope you do that for everybody in town. I, I'm getting like conflicting things. Here. Like, I'm kind of confused. What just like what's going on? Like some people are being like really mean. I can't. So believe this is how Max gets really, really negative. Now yeah. You're gonna kill me, and now you're gonna take me away from my family. Breaker, breaker. Thanks Why for saving me. Carrying the load, good buddy. That's a big ten four. This is not how I wanted to spend my last hour on Earth. Max, can you call my mother in Portland and tell her that I love her? Sure. Justin. Killing me is so not cool. Wow, Max. Right when I finally find a cool chick to date, you have to kill us off. This sucks. <laughs> I know I haven't been the best principal to you. But you've been a great everyday hero for us. Please save us. Hey, is Max Grant? is there. Wait. There's another Max. Where? On the booth. That same oh, booth. Oh, weird. Sat. I know I haven't been the best principal to you. I guess my but husband you've and been new a baby great everyday we'll have hero to go without for me. us. Max, I hope you can live with yourself after this. Don't let the squirrels die. <laughs> That's all you have to say? Hayden. Nothing? You've always had my back, and now you're going to let me die? Thanks, Max. Oh, Max. What exactly was the point of saving me if you're going to let me die? Max, I hope you can live with yourself after this. You've always Kay. had my Please, back, Max, and now you're going me, to let so me we die. Can finally, have our Thanks, tea Max. session. Max, I want you to know how much confidence you gave me. No one ever did that for me. I survived poverty and an abusive family. 
Just so I can end up here to die. Damn, Stella. You've always had my back. I and wish we had been friends, Max. Die. Thanks, but please, Mama. don't let me die like this. I'm still a teenager. Max, I'm truly... I truly am sorry for being such a bastard. You would have been cool to hang out with. I just don't want everybody else to suffer like me. No. Oh. Damn. Okay, let's talk to ourselves, I guess. Wow. Who are you? Holy shit, are you serial? I'm you, dumbass. Or I'm one of many Maxes you've left behind. Can Ooh. you get me out of here? Oh, so you want help? <laughs> Thought you could control everybody and everything, huh? Twist time around your fingers? I tried to help. I only wanted to do the right thing. No, you only wanted to be popular. And once you got these amazing powers, your big plan was to trick people into thinking you give a rat's ass. That's true. That's not true. Not true at all. I do care. That's why I was trying to make friends. By telling people what they want to hear? <laughs> you were just looking for a shortcut because you can't make friends on your own. That's not true. I have great friends. And I've used my powers for good. Please, stop playing innocent. You're a goddamn hypocrite. You've left a trail of death and suffering behind you. That was not my fault, you son of a bitch. Don't you dare talk about our mom that way. <laughs> what about the crap that was your fault? Wait, wait, let me guess. You fucked up time and space for your precious punk Chloe? <laughs> you think she's worth all that? We all are. My best friend, Destiny? I mean, we did it for other people too. Not just yeah. for Chloe. We all are. This isn't about Chloe. Or even me anymore. Gosh. You're so selfless now, Mahatma Max. It's too bad you pissed your power away on high school drama. Chloe does a better job of guilt tripping me than you do. Because you let her bully you. It's called Ooh, Stockholm wow. Syndrome. But you didn't do that homework. So you have to learn the hard way. Like Rachel. Just shut up. You're not scaring me anymore. I'd be more worried about Chloe killing us than Jefferson. Max. Do you really think she's our friend? That she respects us in any way? Man, you are so stupid. <laughs> I'm embarrassed to have the same name. And someday Chloe will destroy... Oh, hell, speak of the devil. Oh, Chloe? shit. Dude, do not even fuck with her head. She knows what we went through together this week, and you don't. There's no way you can break up our team. This is reality. Whoa, look at that. After five years, you're still Max Caulfield. I am seriously glad to see you. Welcome home, Max. Fasten your seatbelt. Oh, what? Oh, wow, I didn't even see myself uh, here. <laughs> I was focusing on the truck. This is so weird. I uh, yeah. know it was your birthday last month. This was my real father's camera. I want you to have it. Yes, of course it's cool. Thank you. This camera is so sweet. Now that we got that mushy shit out of the way, I feel like stage diving. Let's thrash this place. Yep, yep, I'm fucking insane in the brain. Let's dance. Shake that bony white ass. Or take my picture with your new camera. Other moments. This song fucking rules. Can't dance, hippie? Come on. Rock out, girl. Yo, turn it off. Turn it off. You need to hide now. My stepdad will kill me if he finds you here. You were here today, Max. You saved me. I'm still tripping on that. Seeing you after all these years feels like... Destiny. If this is destiny, I hope we can find Rachel. I miss her, Max. 
What the hell is this? Snowflakes? Right, or from episode one. Coming. Max, start from the beginning. Tell me everything. Ooh, look at our shirt. That's different. Yeah. Let's talk about your superpower. Epic! I pledge allegiance to Max and the power for which she stands. You can rewind time, Max. That's fucking insane. We have to play. You need a sidekick to guide you. Okay, girl wonder. Show me the way to Chloe's cave. We gotta see the Welcome bad stuff to too. American Rust, my home away from hell. Raw and rough. It suits you. Max, do you know how awesome this is? I get my best friend back, and she's also super sized. I don't feel so super. Uh, Max, here, um, let me help you find a place to chill. You freaked me out there. Do you feel any better now? You saved me oh. again! <laughs> Crazy. That's cool. Now we're totally bonded for life. Since you're the mysterious superhero, I'll be your faithful chauffeur and companion. My powers might not last, Chloe. That's okay. We will. Forever. Breaking into Wells' office, I think? I'm so glad you're my yeah. partner in crime. As long as you're my partner in time. I might get on the other side of that door before you, Lupin. The race is on. See you soon. Welcome to my domain. You are magic! I have no clue how the hell you got in there, but you did it, sister. 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 Max, you better come check out these files. It's not a drawing. Look. Rachel in the dark room. Rachel in the dark room. Over now and over. Know. That's it. No, As a we're not now. taking the cozy chair. Or Max, the do your powers include tough. mind reading? Or did you just rewind because I tried to steal the chair? Shit, I'm confused. It's the powers of best friendship. I know how you roll. Cowabunga! Oh, 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 oh yeah. Look, an otter in my water. Your power is changing everything, Max. Especially you. I can already tell. You're not so chicken shit anymore. Thanks, girlfriend. And you make me feel like I have a reason for still being in Arcadia Bay. Let's call it a draw. I'm gonna freeze my ass off when I get out. You look cute with your hair soaked in chemicals. Hide! You can't go back to your dorm now. You're a Blackwell fugitive. Crash at my place tonight. It was so fun. Yeah. Go to I have no idea where I'm going. Okay. Photo hog. It feels like a different world from yesterday. We left a skid mark on Blackwell last night. <laughs> Wish we could just hang out all morning like we used to. Maybe we should get up. I have to get back to Blackwell soon. I double dare you. Kiss me now. Oh, right. You're hardcore, Max. Now I can text Warren and tell him he doesn't stand a chance. Unless he's in a girl and girl action. I hope we did. I wonder if I made a mistake by kissing both of them. I don't know. Oh, did you see that little. Oh, we could cruise everywhere um, in this bad boy. Back in can the you last see sequence. Down the coast of Big Sur and beyond. I know. Just daydreaming. It makes me ill that Rachel posed like this for Frank. I wrote him love letters. I can't believe she was banging Frank. Rachel straight up lied to my face. Why didn't she say anything? Because she knew how you would react. And she wasn't much of a friend, huh? Just another person who shits all over me. Why does everybody in my life let me down? 
My dad gets killed, you bail on me for years. My mother gloms on a step fucker. Now Rachel betrays me. Hmm. Not our finest moment. Yeah. Oh, I don't think, where am I going? Go this left, this way. Oh, around? Yeah. Okay. Ah. Not until I see it first. You know the rules, Dad. No. Dude, I am so lucky that my father is cool. Max, you are being so fucking strange. You feel okay? Chloe, I am awesome. We are awesome. <laughs> it's so dark. It's I can't see anything. Weird hanging out with you again. I know. I'm glad we are, though. Look, the worst thing you can do is treat me like a baby. I still want to laugh and talk shit with my best friend. Can we stop? This is seriously the best view of the sunset. What do photographers call that? The golden hour. Sorry about that, I was just adjusting. Yeah, <laughs> we're, it's, we're at four hours right now, so we're kind of getting a little... <laughs> A little, a little creaky. A little tense. We're almost there. Whoa, awesome picture. We look so badass in our pirate gear. We should have taken over our cave, babe, when we had the chance. Listen, Max. My respiratory system is failing, and uh, and it's only getting worse. I've heard the doctors talking about it when they thought I was zonked out. So, I know I'm just putting off the inevitable while my parents suffer along. And I will too. This isn't how I want things to end. What? What are you saying? I'm saying that being with you again has been so special. I just wanted to feel like when we were kids running around Arcadia Bay and everything was possible and you made me feel that way today. I want this time with you to be my last memory. Do you understand? Damn. Ugh. Chloe, you're back. I'm just, I'm just, I'm so glad you're here. You sound high, but thanks for the morning grope. Since we were up all night playing CSI Arcadia Bay, I was still spaced out here trying to put all this info together. There we go. Kate wasn't the first. Yeah. All those binders oh. are filled with other victims. <sighs> Victoria has to be next. Nathan must be planning to dose her tonight at the Vortex Club party. Rachel. This can't be real. These are all, these are all post shots, right? Right? The junkyard! Max, we have to find that spot now! Then, then we can see what he did. There's no way she's dead, no way! She posed for those pictures, Max. I know it, please, let's go. Damn, we gotta relive this. Rachel! Oh, Rachel, no, no, please, not her! Chloe. Getting closer. I'm sorry, Chloe. I'm so sorry. I loved her so much. How can she be dead? What kind of world does this? Who does this? Mm. Come on, Max. We're almost there. This must be present. Like, whoa. Please wake up, wake up, wake up. That's weird. Yeah. Max, come on now. Come on now. Don't worry, don't worry. We'll be Can okay. Can I like get back into our body? Looks like it. Whoa. Are we out of this nightmare? Some trip. Max, Max, can you hear me? Please say something. Chloe, I, I must have passed out. Oh, thank Sorry. God. Don't you ever do that again, okay? 
I swear. But that nightmare was so real. It was so horrible. Whoa. Are we sure we're safe up here? Right. This is my storm. I caused this. I caused all of this. I changed fate and destiny so much that I actually did alter the course of everything. And all I really created was just death and destruction. Fuck all of that, okay? You were given a power. You didn't ask for it. And you saved me. Which had to happen. All of this did. Except for what happened to Rachel. But without your power, we wouldn't have found her. Okay, so you're not the goddamn Time Master, but you're Maxine Caulfield. And you're amazing. Max. This is the only way. No. No I way. I like took the shot a thousand years ago. You. Wait. You could use that photo to and change, change everything, everything right back to when you took that picture. All that would take is for me to. To. Wow, that. what a sacrifice. No. No way. You are my number one priority now. You are all that matters to me. I know. You prove that over and over again. Even though I don't deserve it. I'm so selfish. Not like my mom. Look what she had to give up and live through. And she did. She deserves so much more than to be killed by a storm in a fucking diner. Even my... My stepfather deserves her alive. There's so many more people in Arcadia Bay who should live. Way more than me. Don't say that. I won't trade you. You're not trading me. Maybe you've just been delaying my real destiny. Look at how many times I've almost died or actually died around you. Look at what's happened in Arcadia Bay ever since you first saved me. Damn. I know I've been selfish, but for once, I think I should accept my fate. Our fate. Chloe. Max, you finally came back to me this week, and you did nothing but show me your love and friendship. You made me smile and laugh like I haven't done in years. Wherever I end up after this, in whatever reality, all those moments between us were real, and they'll always be ours. No matter what you choose, Stop. I, I have to make a choice right, right here. Decision. No. Chloe, I can't make this choice. No, Max. You're the only one who can. Fuck that. What? <laughs> you gotta be kidding. <laughs> this is horrible. Huh? Sacrifice Chloe or the entire town? Oh my gosh. Pause. We need a pause for the. Really? I did not. I, think I they mean, I should have expected expected they would throw a big choice at us at the end. So that means everyone dies. I guess. Which that's a pretty big sacrifice. To just. <sighs> we got this vision when we got our powers. So, like, why did we have the vision in the first place? Was it just because, be like, before we had even used it? So, yeah. at that point, 
we hadn't messed with anything yet. Yeah, we still had that vision. Was it like a warning of things to come yeah. if we used the power? But why did we get the power in the first place? I hate this. So, Sacrifice Arcadia Bay. Does that mean like everyone died? Like, or is it just what we've seen? Like, people, some people die, some people live. I mean, like, the way Chloe said it, her mom would die at least. I mean, that's true, because when we were there, it, that, the storm would, it wasn't even, like, hadn't even breached it yet. Yeah, it's just like, I don't know, is it moving? It's just stayed in one spot this whole time, it feels like. But I feel like they're implying it's either all of the, all of the people, yeah. right? Or Warren. Chloe. All your friends. All of our friends. Kate. Like, it would definitely be a selfish choice to choose Chloe. Yeah. Damn. I can't... Chloe? I just... Ugh, like, everything we've been doing has been to save Chloe. I know. And... I guess and it's... then she died, and then she came back. And then, you know, at the end of the last episode, we are like, Ugh, I hope we can bring back Chloe. And then we did. But then now we're gonna kill her! Essentially, it feels like the right choice to me. Yeah. To let let Chloe go, I guess. But it sucks. I don't want to play it anymore. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at Max. I think I'm going to sacrifice Chloe. Damn. What would you do? Honestly, I'll, I'll give you this one since it's a tough one. I think I personally... I'm, like, okay, so is it official that this is... Like, Max is the cause of the storm? I guess so. Everyone seems to agree. Then I think I would... And not even use this power in the first place. I think I'd have to sacrifice Chloe then. The fact that she said do it... It'd be hard if she was like, please, Max, don't do it. And she pleaded. But the fact that she said do it, Max... Which uh, yeah, it takes a lot to say. But... And... I will say it is like... Uh, it's interesting how it does feel like no matter what we do, Chloe always ends up dying. Yeah. So if we save her now, well, like what's to say that she won't die from something else in the future and then we go through this all over again? Right. Tough decision. Oh, she went for it. Max, it's time. Chloe, I'm so, so sorry. I, I don't want to do this. I know, Max, but we have to. We have to save everybody, okay? And you'll make those fuckers pay for what they did to Rachel. Being together this week, it was the best farewell gift I could have hoped for. You're my hero, Max. Chloe, I'm going to miss you so much. <laughs> Man, dude. I'll always love you. Now get out of here, please. Do it before I freak. And Max Caulfield, don't you forget about me. Never. Wow. One last focus. Bro, we just get the, we're going to witness it too.
It's cool, Nathan. <laughs> Don't stress. You're, you're okay, bro. Just count to three. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. <laughs> you're the boss. Damn. So what do you want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step-ass would say. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where'd you get that? What are you doing? Come on, put that thing down. Don't ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me. You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would wow. they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! Wow, man. So I walked into the haze and a million dirty ways. Now I see you lying there. Official. Like rocks and shoreline sand. He comes in. Still dead summer I cannot bear. And I wipe the sand from my eyes. They still get Jefferson. No storm. Now are we going to the funeral? <laughs> that sucks. <laughs> oh, really? <sighs> of course. She has a doll.
This was so weird. Break. I think that's it. That's the end. Wow. I know. <sighs> wow. But I feel like the other ending would have been just as depressing. <laughs> I feel like it, right? I mean, there was... There would have been multiple funerals. Yeah, I'm, I'm just very curious what it, that one would be. I wonder if any, like, either one feels more right than the other. Like, I, I would say this one felt... Like how it should? Like, story-wise, it felt like it, it wrapped it up well. Yeah. Like, it, it came full circle. Of right. Another hard hitting emotional ending. Such a cruel choice. It's a very cruel choice. Man, yeah, this episode though, the whiplash was crazy. Whiplash, crazy. We went through like four different <laughs> oh timelines. My gosh. We heard Jefferson talk. I mean, Jefferson getting out of the dark room, the storm was coming, then going back multiple times. We kissed Warren. At one point, David. Shot uh, Jefferson yeah. in the head. We got a text message from Pompadou. From Pompadou. Oh my, that whole, the, yeah. Oh wow. Oh my goodness. Whip yeah, that was crazy. All in four hours. Four and a half. 420. Did that end how you thought it would end? No. Neither. I mean, I, I guess I didn't really have. I wasn't sure because this whole story has been so crazy, but... Yeah, I didn't think it would come back to Max. Right, because this yeah, whole time... Yeah, I feel he... like I should have thought about that earlier, but... Yeah, I know. It didn't even cross my mind. That Max caused the storm? And we'll just never know why she had these powers in the first place. That kind of stinks, right? That's like, oh, you have these powers. It's like, well, it's some t 
test from... Yeah, because we thought it could be related to, like, the Native American land that the right. Prescotts were building on and some sort of, I don't know, just things related to that, but... It's just hard to, it's hard to wrap, wrap my brain around, like, what's, like, the canon events now? Like, what's... Yeah, I am curious, because there are other games, I imagine they're completely different characters. But is there a certain series of choices that are considered canon? Right. Like, like for the main choices, at yeah. least. Yeah, great music, of course. Absolutely. Paying the butt for copyright, but that's okay. <laughs> oh, look! It's an actual song! The backwards one. That's great. <laughs> I love that Funny. song. Yeah, when that, that song came out, when we first heard it on the game, that was the first time I ever heard the song. Mm. It was, you know, obviously when you play, played it last year. Um, yeah, like, I, that song, I have a Spotify playlist, and I always played it, you know, occasionally, so. So it just always reminded me of, I played it throughout the whole time from then to when we started it up, started it up again, so it was like, oh, we, get, we, gotta, we gotta play this game at some point, so. I'm glad we finally wrapped it up. As depressing as it was, or sad, heartbreaking as it was, rather. Missed a lot more pictures once again, but that's oh, yeah. okay. I had a good, I had a good run the first three episodes. It was just hard because I feel like a few of those were, were in those dream sequences, but yeah, that whole section. While I liked the idea, was probably my least favorite part of the entire game. I would say so too. It was just really annoying. Yeah. Like the part where you're the guys with the flashlights. Yeah. So they really just they made us experience this whole story of friendship, getting to know Chloe. All just for us to have to take it away yep. to save everyone. So it's I terrible. guess terrible. There really really was no like love interest in the with end. With Chloe? Or like just in general, right? Like like you don't end up with somebody. Sort of. Yeah, so not, all, not officially. So there's all people, that's when people bring in like, oh, it would have been great if they would have ended up together. You know. I'm sure there's some Chloe, Victoria, you know, <laughs> ships, whatever they're called. Well, it's a big learning experience for Max, I guess. Yeah. Not just about, I mean, don't mess with time, but also... I don't know, just about so many things. I mean, I guess it was, in many ways, a, a bit of a coming-of-age story as well. Yeah. Because at the beginning, she didn't really know, I guess, who she was. I imagine the other end, they're just, like, there watching the whole town get destroyed. Yeah. That would feel awful. Too. I don't know, it's tough. It's a tough choice. Well, I suppose we'll be able to see what most of you you people yes. chose at the end of this. When yeah. We see the final choices. Okay, here we go. What if it's Did like? I make the what if it's like five percent? Ooh. So I, it was in the minority. Interesting. Forty-five percent sacrifice Chloe. I can I definitely understand not sacrificing her because the story was so much about them and their bond and how close they were. Yeah. David got a scar during the fight. Interesting. Huh. David didn't kill Jefferson. 50-50. Very close. You saved the trucker. 28% of you bastards did not. You saved Alyssa, how could we not? You saved the fisherman. You helped Joyce believe in David again. So, oh, interesting. A lot of you guys weren't didn't feel for David's cha uh, his change of heart. His right. Redemption arc. Uh-huh. You told the truth about Rachel to Frank. You kissed Warren. 70% just didn't do anything. Wow. Rude, you didn't show Warren any affection. So can we go That's through it. all of the episodes? Yeah, I think if we go back to the menu, but... So who, I wonder who died, what if it's, like, would it be, would it be, how would you feel if, like, the town got destroyed, but, like, no one important died? Like, of your circle. They're not gonna do that, though, right? 
Like what, like only Joyce dies or something? But again, it goes back to the same thing. You, we, every time we try to save Chloe, it, it doesn't work. No, I want to see it. Do we do we watch it really quick? Sure. Well, maybe we should do our final thoughts first, and then we can. All right. Do you want to see that? Really like quick. everything. Oh yeah. Uh, we can check out our choices, I believe. From all the episodes, I know it's been asked a few times. So all the way back from what? Yeah. This is the beginning? Yes. Uh, I think we did actually look at these. Yeah. Maybe. As it went until the second one, is when we stopped. Out of time. Okay. 50 50 on that. Told Kate to wait, answered Kate. Didn't try to shoot, shoot Frank, was. Ooh, 50 50 on that. He saved Kate's life. You blamed Nathan. Yeah. I wonder what happens if you blame Jefferson. Yeah, interesting. So people probably killed the plant. But that's in the majority, so... But we did keep the plant alive. Yeah. You helped Alyssa, erased the link, or unfriendly, or friendly with Taylor, rather. Accepted Warren's invitation, 71%. All you Brooke haters out there. <laughs> Wrote a message on Frank's car. 50-50. So it's better not to tamper with the rail tracks, I assume. Yeah. Gain entry to the party. Ooh, 50-50 helped Warren versus didn't help Warren. I wonder why. Was it just hard to... Cause that, was that the one where you had to like talk we, to Grant? I did. I think we did look it up. Yeah, I looked we? it up for that one. You told on David to Mr. Jefferson. Okay. Lisa, who's Lisa? The plant. Oh, see? Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Lisa! Survive. You helped Warren with his exam. Oh, that's right. What was the consequences of that? I don't know. Um, you are not on the Vortex Club party list. Ooh. So how do you get on it? I don't know. You erased some names from the Vortex Club party list. I wonder if that's hard to find. Yeah. You erased the cop's answer phone message. Helped Alyssa. Uh, warned the homeless woman. A lot of people did not. Maybe they... Why wouldn't you warn her? Interesting. You took a photo in the past. You didn't take it in the past. You didn't leave a mark on the fireplace. Okay. And then this is the last one that we... We did save the blue jay. So as nice. official, we did save the blue jay. I was thinking about that throughout this episode, wondering if somehow we would see it again. Nice. You didn't disturb the bird's nest. We couldn't even find it. It was a no. photo. You found David's code. You got David's files in another way. Interesting. How else could you do it? Yeah. Kate helped you find Nathan's room. You motivated Daniel to attend the Vortex Club party. 30% of you did not. I'm surprised on how, how much we're in the minority on some yeah. of this. You, we're only 26% on Warren's slate. Oh, we didn't figure out Nathan's pin code. So we could have. And you helped Alyssa, of course. Our group, and then... And that's everything. We saw the rest of the polarized. Wow. And the minority of... Interesting. Now, yeah, I feel like we really have to see it now. Yeah, we have to see the <laughs> ending. But um, overall, great experience. Yeah. I had a really fun time. This sort of game is right up my alley. As sure. many of you know, based on my other, you know, choice-based games experiences, I really like the characters, and I think it was especially fun for us because we grew up, like, we were this age during this time period so a yeah. lot of stuff felt really relatable and kind of like a walk down memory lane if you will for sure and i know we gave a lot of characters a lot of crap throughout <laughs> just for you know just for fun yeah. but i do like that they wrote the story in a way that there was a lot of gray area yes that even the worst excusing jefferson but like even the worst characters like david had a reason for being the way that they were. Yeah. Um, it didn't excuse what they did, 
which is why I still stand behind my choice to like <laughs> tell on David to Joyce. Yeah. But it was nice to see him express remorse or even Nathan, you know, he came from a really crappy background with his awful father mm. and then being manipulated by Jefferson and clearly needing help from like medical professionals. Like you can still feel sympathy for for a lot of people. Yeah. Which I liked. And Victoria as well. And you also have to keep in mind that a lot of these characters are still teenagers. Like they're young, they're living on their own and at such a young age, just trying True. to figure out life, life, romance, their Everything. future. Yeah. It's a tough time. I still don't know what I'm doing with my life. <laughs> <laughs> In my late twenties, so overall the remastered obviously we don't know what the regular version is like. Yeah. It was definitely a little bit buggy and glitchy at points. Especially towards the end. Um, in the end, it was a little bit frustrating with that one little bug. And then just some weird stuff with the character models. Yeah, like glitching, glitching out, out sometimes. And stuff. Uh, but overall, I think it played pretty well. I love the art style. Aesthetically the, pleasing the game. The journal was great. I loved all of the illustrations in Max's journal. Yeah. Um, and I do feel like a lot of the choices did have an impact throughout the narrative which I appreciated. It was no Detroit Become Human where there's completely hugely different timelines, mm. but like we had continued stuff with Kate after saving her. And some of the choices that we made early on were mentioned several episodes later. Yeah. Which some choice-based games like The Walking Dead didn't do as much. Mm -hmm. So I really enjoyed that. Yeah, and the fact that like you can rewind and play out different outcomes totally adds a whole new layer of choice-based gaming mm -hmm. right because it's like you can't do that at that right moment it's like uh i'm gonna kill this guy but then let's just see what happens if i don't kill him right it's truly the complete opposite of so many other choice-based games where you're on a time limit yes which adds it's it's just a completely different challenge where overthinkers like us will spend a lot of time trying to figure out the right choice yeah I think um, which adds it helps with discussion and that's true and makes you kind of try to predict where the story might go but in many instances it didn't go the way that we thought it would yeah. based on the choices that we made yeah I think both can, like having I could I could probably argue that having all, like all this time and being able to like take back your choices is just as stressful as like being tied with your choices because mm -hmm. it's like they're stressful for very different reasons. Mm -hmm. I liked that it was kind of, in many ways, a bit of a detective story. You know, we were trying to figure out this whole thing with Rachel and eventually Jefferson and the Prescotts. And the storm. And I love collecting clues and trying to figure out who's behind what. There were some nice twists and turns, of course. Yeah. And... Just, yeah, just a good game to talk about and to theorize. And Absolutely. Yeah, it was great on. seeing everyone's comments on this series and just your thoughts and also like the nostalgia behind it. For sure, yeah. You guys left some great comments and we always appreciate that. And you, a few of you guys even said that you, uh, you've seen stuff that you've never seen before in the playthrough. Yeah. So that was really cool. But any thoughts as far as the overall story? Just the lesson, I guess, to take from everything. Because you don't want to be like, oh, you can't change fate. But does the game, you think it goes in that direction? To some extent, but also most people don't really have the opportunity. <laughs> Did I yeah. say most people? No one can change fate in this way. Right. I think, I guess, if I would take any lesson from it, it's just to think carefully about the choices you make and how they impact other people. Right, the because chain effects. Because every, yeah, the butterfly effect. Chain reactions, know. butterfly, yeah. Because every single choice we made impacted not only us, but the people around us, our yeah. friends, and yeah, just really, and also try to understand people and try to, right. even if a person isn't someone you would see yourself being friends with, that doesn't mean that they don't have their own story and their own place in this world and who knows maybe you could get along better than you think exactly okay i guess we're done
All right. Was, was with we, with the base game. At base least. game. Oh yeah. Right. So we'll probably. I guess we want to say that for, like, what we want to plan to do with like, before the storm. Oh yeah. So just just so you guys know, if you've watched this far, um, yes. we'll take a little break before we play before the storm to finish up Resident Evil Village. Yeah. And then we'll probably hop back on it. I think. At least to do that. I don't know when we'll play Life is Strange 2. That might be a little bit of a longer break. Break. We'll see. But we'll definitely be playing Before the Storm in the next couple of weeks. Yeah. Several weeks. Okay. Let's let's check out the other end. Yeah. So I'm very, very, very curious. Okay. Here we go. I guess we're going to watch the Sacrifice Arcadia Bay uh, ending. I'm, I'm nervous. Here we go. How's that volume? Bam. I'm gonna miss that sound. Max, it's time. Not anymore. Oh. Max, I'll always be with you. Forever. Uh, we did say like yeah we never leave her i know look at it go though I know, that would be so... I feel so guilty. You know? Yeah. Like, you just could... Like, you have so many people's love. I don't know. I mean, you got Chloe's mom in there, too. Right. Like. Let's see. Did anyone survive that? Die. Does. Whoa. That's interesting. And a baby. Yeah. We were We were She looks pretty miserable. I'm miserable, but she just looks... I don't know. Wait, they're just leaving? Wait, they just leave the town? No way. That's the ending. Wait, no way. Huh? I don't think I like that one. It's just fuck everyone else <laughs> and we just leave? <sighs> what? So then you do assume that everyone died. Like everyone? Wow. That is fucked. I mean, yeah, you get Chloe, but... I'm just thinking of the long-term effects on that. 
Like, just, you would feel that guilt for the rest of your life. Like, like everyone. Like, at least with Chloe, she said, like, she said we could make that choice to, like, she felt like it was, it made sense. But yeah. with everyone else, they didn't have a choice. Like, we literally held their lives in our hands. <laughs> they just dip? And there's no, like, oh, my mom just died. Yeah, I was expecting For, at least to, I don't know, see someone's body and, like, have a bit of a moment. They just rev the engine and never look back. It definitely feels like a less Im- less impactful ending to me. After seeing that, I'm glad we didn't. I think I... Uh, like, it still sucks that Chloe yeah, dies, for sure. for sure. But that ending just feels... Now, we did get the dough. Some doughs in that ending. But... Wow. Maybe they were both... What was that line? Rich was lying? Maybe, maybe they were both Leos. They never looked back. Wow. Well, interesting. Also, I did I did briefly see a comment on one of those videos that we just watched um, talking about Joyce. And it does suck for her, the Chloe dies ending. You know, she has to go through the grief all over again of yeah, losing not just, I mean, family, but her child, which is, you know, a completely different type of mm-hmm. grief. Um, so that sucks. But all of these, yeah, I don't know. It just felt like, I know, it's just, to just leave, I guess I can't do anything, but still, it didn't feel like they put a lot more into the Chloe's death ending. You know, than just the, like it felt the last ending, Chloe's saving Chloe, just felt like, okay, we need to have two endings here. Let's just uh, have them the town destruct all and just, you know, gone, and then they can just take off and leave. That's the end, mm-hmm. go together. Yeah. So I felt like that one just felt a little bit rushed. Yeah, and I feel like, I mean, Chloe at the end there, it was definitely a bit of a different Chloe than we had seen through much of the game. Yeah. And I don't know, I just, I feel like it just made more sense to take that sacrifice. I don't know. As always, you know, with most games when we finish them, we usually like to take a little time to think about it for sure so i don't think we'll be doing like a whole discussion video or anything about this but maybe if we have any thoughts before we start uh before the storm we could mention them in that video or Mm -hmm. just in a comment or something but look forward to hearing your thoughts which ending you chose maybe you have more to add to the you know the other ending for sure than we have thought of But again, thank you guys so much for joining us on this journey, this good old story-based game journey. Yes. We have had a great time, a stressful time, but a good time. Absolutely. And a great time. (laughs) (laughs) Uh, Okay. Can you tell it is past lunchtime? Wow. I'm ready to go eat. Yes. Thank you guys for being here, and we will see you in the next one. Bye. Bye.